Hello and welcome to Filthy Questline Presents One Shot or Not. Today we'll be playing Star Wars in honor of Star Wars Day. May the 4th be with you. Uh, this is the Saga edition of Star Wars by Chris Perkins. Uh, you can find us on a Filthy Lot Twitch channel or, or you can go to our YouTube, uh, which is a Filthy Lot. Uh, we'd like to start by acknowledging uh, the privilege that it is to work and play on the traditional uh, territory of the Squamish Nation. Uh, we'll start things off by introducing our little short story here, Old Clone Stories. And we're going to begin with this little fellow. Who's that? Oh, that looks like me. I believe that's a lot. <laughs> <laughs> um, Roy, <laughs> I was an ARC in the Grand Army. They hit that switch and all my fellow soldiers turned. I didn't, so I left. I became a married man, fell in love. She got sick. She's not here anymore. She left me with one final gift, a pet womp rat. Then, during an Imperial raid, that womp rat was killed and taken from me also. Everyone keeps asking me if I'm back in it. Yeah. I'm thinking I'm back. <laughs> Following right behind you, a fellow former clone trooper. I believe that's Andrew. That looks like me. Uh, yeah. Well, my backstory is not as great as uh, exposed as my friend over here, but yeah, uh, I, I learned to blow things up at a younger age. Uh, kept blowing things up. Clone troop, the Clone Wars were tough on everyone, but uh, especially me, I took an explosive shock to the head. When everyone else started turning on the Jedi, I, I just didn't, I didn't know what was going on. So I had to make myself scarce. Uh, linked up with this one, a couple other ones. Here we are today. Following and final clone trooper of this bunch, Lauren. Hello. On CT-075, also known as Seeker. It's been a tough time, you see. I, unfortunately, did turn on my Jedi, and I'm very ashamed about it. I murdered the Padawan in cold blood, and it stays, stays with me. I'll never forget the way she looked at me in those last moments. Before we got back to Kamano, I got out. I snuck out on an escape pod, never looked back. I ended up running into these people over the years, hoping to get a little payback. And chirping along behind Lauren is uh, Roz. Can you introduce your character? I can. Uh, following quite close to you, as we have uh, been companions, is uh, your little astromech. And, uh, you know, kind of sassy, just hanging out, traveling behind you. That's my backstory. <laughs> um, so, yeah. So you find yourselves uh, <laughs> traveling to Coruscant, uh, where you've been given an invitation to Moshi Bar, a famous uh, cantina here, uh, usually rife with uh, scum and villainy. Mm. But in this case, you've been requested here because of your unique set of skills. As former clone troopers, it seems someone's been tipped off about you and wants to hire you for a job. All too eager, you enter into the bar, looking for some semblance of this thing. Uh, and as you enter, you find that droids are indeed allowed in this establishment. <laughs> Classy. <laughs> Classy joint. Uh, in fact, um, the bouncer doesn't appear to be at the doorfront, but instead, uh, is waiting at the bar. Let's get a drink, guys. Yeah, uh, what do you guys want to do? I'm just going to like, can I move a little farther down that back wall? 
and just, yeah, kind of hug the wall and just kind of like clock the place, see if I get any, uh, or get the right guy. On nope, the two, on the you two are this one. <laughs> So as you get about here, you notice that slithering off the stage, a female hut mm. who looks at you and stares into your eyes for a moment as she says, Hachu a panky, kopa and hatachichu. Eh, ma'am. She appears to be wiggling <laughs> at you. Oh. <laughs> it seems like she just finished her set. Uh, anybody speak Hatties here? Anybody? Anybody? <laughs> Uh, you hear help. you hear the, the beeps in binary from your droid as they take off the opposite direction from you oh. and straight towards a gambling port. <laughs> it checks out. So you just see uh, the flash of uh, I've got a lot of yellow and orange plating on my little astromech, and you can spot the uh, code stamped in the side C H E E Z or Z. Uh, so you just call me Cheese. Um, and yeah, beeline it for any gambling. Immediately inserting uh, into the, uh, the port, you begin to pull up all the odds uh, for it, and you take some of the strictest odds, as you know they pay out the highest. Would you like to make a wager? I would totally like to make a wager. You boot up your gambling suite after worrying a little bit. You calculate the odds quickly. And then can I get a used computer check from you? Yes, you can. To tilt the odds in your favor, you begin to slice. <gasps> that sounds like me. Holy moly. Uh, 36. <laughs> uh, is that with the plus two for gambling? No. <laughs> so uh, 38. There you go. Incredible. Uh, yeah, you begin to uh, coast through it, and you start immediately placing odds on uh, the uh, pod races on Malastare. And as, uh, as you're about to see a familiar Doug crossing the finish line, you quickly shift all of your bets to him without the computer catching you. As it pays you out, 700 credits. Whoa! Can we see that from over there? Can I see that from over there? Uh, you heard something rude in binary as they did not take your call for help with the, the hut lady over here. Bloody droids. <laughs> eh but they've gone to work all on their own. What are the rest of you doing? I'm gonna go to the bar and get a drink. Walking up in your shiny armor. Mm-hmm. Uh, coming over there, you notice a Deveronian with uh, red skin and large horns polishing a glass turn to you. What do you want? Hey, mate, what's good? Everything. You want some fire water? Yeah, I take some fire water. All right, that'll be three credits. You gotta pay up front. No, no, you. Here's three credits then. And one for you. Just takes the bottle and hands you the glass as he downs it. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Chucks it. Yay. Breaks behind him. <laughs> I like this place. <laughs> <laughs> this place has character. Um, the. Both right behind me. Who's in it? Right behind you? Yes. Seems to be some sort of bounty hunter. Um, right, so I want to stay where I am and get a, a read on everyone in the space, try to mark my, my, my entrances and exits, mm -hmm. if there are any uh, pencils around, just keeping an eye on on my on like my tactical advantages and disadvantages in in the space. Yeah, the bounty hunter turns and looks through looks at you through his goggles. Seems to be glaring at you. What's your will defense? My will defense is 19. Pretty good. Don't seem intimidated by him. I uh I make uh no expression with my face and just He continues to drink without breaking eye contact. Cool. Um, I'm still uh, uh, sur surveying my surroundings. Is he the most dangerous looking man in the room? Everyone's got a, an edge to them. This guy's got an extra chip 
on his shoulder with that mm. edge. Mm. Okay. Uh, cool. Uh, without putting my hand on my gun, I'm just going to keep that finger handy, and I'm going to look around at everyone else to break eye contact with him and look around everywhere else. But that snap up is going to be for him if he does something I don't like. As soon as you break eye contact, you hear him <laughs> finish his drink. As he begins to walk past you, nudge you, and head out the door. Mm -hmm. Meanwhile, our little hut encounter, uh, it seems that her tail has somehow snaked its way around your leg. Mm. <laughs> um, well, 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 well. Uh, what's the, is it common that we speak? Common leg? Is that just with the regular languages? Is it was called common? B -b basic. Uh, yeah. Can I, yeah, basic, yeah. Uh, it's basic. Yeah. Can, I, can I find out it? Can I ask Galactic her if she basic. speaks basic? Yeah. Or? Uh, yeah, you, you start going through, and she just shakes her head uh, as she puts a hand on your chest and begins to pull you towards the back room. No, oh, uh. I'm going to go with it for the time being. <laughs> Yo, you're going to smash that. Yeah. <laughs> you're, not the, you're not the only gambler there, cheese. <laughs> So, uh, yeah, you disappear into a back room. Well, I'm all the way back there now? Ay, ay, ay. <laughs> uh, okay, uh, what's, what's in that back room? You just you and the hut. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> Can I uh, clock that and start heading my way to kind of just give him some backup, maybe hang out, loiter around the, bar, the uh, door, sip on my drink? Uh, so you want to move towards the back here? Yeah. Uh, you get to this access door, mm -hmm. it's locked. Mm -hmm. Okay, just gonna all hang the, out here all and... The, all the doors on the way in are all been locked? Like, did she lock them behind us? Um, it seems like this, uh, as you um, uh, read the door, uh, in Abresh it says, employees only. All right then, apparently you're an employee now. Yeah. Do we have our comms on at this point? You do. All right. So assuming the uh, hut can't pick this up, just be like, well, I'm sure you'll use our code word if you're having any troubles. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'll, let you, I'll let you guys know. Don't, it's better not to piss off huts. You never know who her, her brother or cousin may be, or sister for that matter, or mother. <laughs> However the huts do it, I don't know. <laughs> I, uh... <laughs> just, <laughs> just turn the comms off from the minute there. Uh, cheese, um, it seems that you've tripped some sort of thing. You've won too much. You've won an additional thousand credits uh, as this thing has locked you out. It will not let you gamble anymore. You like smash into it with your body a few times. <laughs> Very frustrated, but it will not pay out any more money. Um, as I'm swearing in binary. Uh, I'll just like slowly rotate my dome a bit just to notice where Seeker is. Um, that, you know, mm -hmm. you've moved over to another spot. Uh, and I'll disengage from the comm, yep. the computer, and I'll work my way, you know. At first I want to do my little like waddle stomp, like, ah, ah, so <laughs> mad. Uh, and then I'll just engage my wheels and head over towards Seeker. Yeah, putting down uh, your third appendage, you begin to wheel your way around as you get over to Seeker. Sees that no one really pays you much mind. I will slowly open like one of my little Seeker compartments and be like, thermal detonator? You're really misreading this, this interaction right now. <laughs> Give it some time. I'll, uh, Maybe later. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I would like to look for the person who hired us. <laughs> oh. Yes. Um, wandering around, do you remember that uh, talking to the bartender, if you give them the passphrase about a blue milk run, you'll learn a little more. About a? Blue milk run. Right. Uh, so yeah, I'll, uh, I'll stride up t t to the b b bar. I won't sit down, but I will uh, lean against it. Yep. Oh, you see an um, intoxicated Deveronian behind the bar. <laughs> yeah. And uh, I just like t tap t t t t t twice, almost like in, uh, in, in audibly. 
as you tap twice, a beer is checked in your direction. Uh, make a reflex. What's your reflex defense? My reflex defense is 25. Not quite. Pretty, pretty well there. Uh, 23. You do catch it. Okay. Or it impacts you. Uh, I just rest it down and I say, uh, I'm here to see a man about a blue m m m milk run. And you want the other bottle. And he throws another one at you. Still doesn't, you're still able to catch it. Okay. Break it somewhere else. Okay. Uh, I take that b bottle and I, uh, I uh, walk to the empty booth at the entrance where the bounty hunter was. Uh, the bottle just looks like a, a bottle? You notice that the label is entirely covering the bottle. It appears to be made out of some kind of glass. Okay. Cool. Uh, I'll just... Yeah, breaking the neck of it, you see inside, is a key card to the back room. Cool. All right, let's, let's move. Yeah, there's an entrance You're right You're going to go here. join up with the rest of them? Yeah. Walking around, it seems that several Bith have taken the stage in place of the, the hut lady and uh, have begun playing familiar tunes. <laughs> you know that song. It's that one. Familiar non-copywritten tunes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're the one they play in all the Star Wars bars. <laughs> it's a jam. Remix! <laughs> Reaching the door, you're able to unlock it quite easily now. Yep. As you head into the back. Meanwhile, inside, <laughs> our fearless leader, <laughs> please make an endurance check. No, oh, no. Endurance, where are we here? Uh, it's just a 20? Yeah. I know it's on here somewhere. Oh, yeah. Plus 12. It's like 40. 16. Yeah. <laughs> Seems this uh, this hut has more stamina than you. Uh, good thing I got my helmet on still. <laughs> <laughs> Did my helmet have like little wind? It seems that <laughs> shield wipers. <laughs> it seems that every part of your armor except your helmet has been taken off. Oh, oh. <laughs> and in its place, some slimy lubricant that seems to make it easy to take your armor off. Oh no, easy there, sweetheart. Easy, easy. Uh, <laughs> uh, you still I don't got know. like your under like armor. Yeah, under. yeah, yeah, yeah. Like I don't know how far from. I want to go. Like, am I gonna like do it with a hut woman? Like, <laughs> make a galactic lore check. A galactic lore check. Oh, geez. Seventeen. Good number. Pretty good. Yeah. Um, looking around the room, you notice that on the desk um, there is a terminal for your crit sticks. You get the feeling that if you stay any longer, you're going to have to... Oh, shell out some money. Uh, okay. Uh, yeah, I'm just going gonna, gonna to make excuses about how the bank account's been overdrawn. Try to, like, slip back into my armor. If not, like, is the door open? Uh, she... It, it, she closed it, but it's not locked. It's not locked? Okay. Uh, I'll take off my helmet really quick, just briefly. A little smooch. Get my stuff, and I got to go. <laughs> if I can, you hear if she a allows me. a string of things in Hatice, and all you can understand is Bantha poop. Yeah, 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 <laughs> I thought so. Not the first time. <laughs> so you quickly uh, pull your armor back on. Yeah, whoop, whoop. When you come back into the hallway, you bump into everyone else. Oh, hey there. Hey. You're never going to live this down. Hey there, boy. Hey there. Yeah. They don't call me dice for nothing, but see, sometimes I gamble, sometimes I don't want to gamble. <laughs> uh, I don't, I don't. I don't yeah, say anything, agreed. but I do, uh, I just check my watch. Go, hmm. It wasn't like that. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, you head to the end of the hallway where you notice that your key card, colored blue, will allow you entry into the back room. And as you gather around a table, 
you notice that there is a hollow emitter on it. Standing around it, the lights dim in the room as it activates. And you see a woman in white robes with short hair, short red hair. You know this to be a senator, Mon Mothma. She looks at you all. Thank you for responding to our call for help. Our rebellion is all that remains to push back the empire. You have the skills to help us succeed in this mission. I will refer to my general, Dodonna. May the force be with you. As she bows and fades, the light comes back up as an older general, based on his insignia, man appears to you. Right, our intelligence reports tell us that you are former clone troopers and one droid. Recently, the Empire has decided to nationalize the Incom Corporation for further starfighter development and production. Mm -hmm. Of course, the employees of this company are not too thrilled with this turn of events. They do not wish to help the Empire any further. So, it is up to you to infiltrate this facility. Get these scientists and their plans for a new starfighter and bring back hope for our Starfleet. Right. It's an escort mission. Oh, a great. recovery and escort mission. Mm. Not a demolition mission, though? As you can see from these coordinates, and he uh, pushes the button and changes from a hollow of himself to a planet that underneath an arbrush co uh, is called Frezia. You will travel to this planet and land at these coordinates. They are outside a canyon leading into the facility. Minerals located inside of this canyon will deflect nearly all scanners. This is a perfect opportunity for you to enter into the facility through a waste pipe using your droid's ability to slice. Once inside, make your way to the hangar bay where these scientists will have prepped your new starfighters and an escape route. Do you have any questions about your mission? What kind of resistance are we going to meet along the way? The Empire has only just recently nationalized this company, this corporation. Expect to find a private security force. The Empire is not due there for another two weeks. I like private security. They're easy. They're dumb. Yeah. Fresia is only one hyperlane away from Coruscant. It will not take you long to get there. Do not delay. What do you guys think? What kind is of facility it, uh, is it? Does it pay? Is it big? You will receive payment upon delivery. Mm. Right. I might have to tell my, my hut lady, come back later. <laughs> Pop open my little like box again, and it just kind of shows you the thermal detonator again. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, we'll get to that. We'll get to that. It's coming. <laughs> so you accept the mission then? I yeah. accept. I accept. Yeah. Why not? When you leave Fresio with the package, contact me here, and I will give you the coordinates for a jump. So what was the package that we're taking? Do we know what the package is yet? Package is uh, four scientists mm. and schematics Okay. for a new starfighter. So are you saying that we're going to be getting in and out on the same ship or that we're supposed to be stealing ships at the same time as well as the schematics? You have your own ship that will allow you to uh, jump in uh, your Corellian freighter. Uh, once inside, uh, you can choose to leave on those ships that are in there and head back and get your own ship, mm -hmm. or just leave on those ships and figure out your own ship later. Just but this ship has carried you for quite some time. Yeah, okay. leave the ship. We're not going to abandon it. All right. 
Does Fessiania have any uh, local inhabitants? As far as you know, or as far, <clears throat> as far as we know, only Incom is on this planet. They've chosen it for an aquatic world as is ideal for testing starfighter conditions. Oh, it's a water planet? It's a water planet. Oh, All water? Slightly volcanic. Okay. Mostly water? Yeah, you know that the facility is located on uh, a volcanic island. Okay. I beep away a little bit, um, but you understand me, uh, Seeker, that I'm saying scientists. So do they need to still be alive? Yeah, they need to still be alive, but I'm sure this private security force will uh, need to be taught a lesson. Anybody who sides with the Emperor are dead. Deserve what they get. Yeah, only good imp is a dead imp. Uh, yeah, you know that um, Incom is comprised of many different species. So for the Empire to move in here, they would remove those species, leaving only humans. Racists. Space always racists. And droids, probably. <laughs> <laughs> beep beep, obviously. <laughs> How you come and go is up to you. Good luck, and may the force be with you. May the force yes. be with you, General. The calm closes and self-destructs. Whoa. Cool. <laughs> Sick. Awesome. All right. Yeah. Uh, let's not, sorry, <clears throat> let's not waste any time. Right, let's go to the ship. All right. You begin to exit, uh, exit the bar here. And as you come out the entrance here, you walk about 500 meters to where your ship Sweet. is in the landing bay. <laughs> Amazing. Uh, uh, the who's ship the is pilot so among bouncy. you? Who's the pilot? I can fly. You're a great pilot. I wouldn't say I'm the great. I'm <laughs> adequate. You're, uh, you're a better pilot than me. Yeah. I only got my pilot, my real pilot license a couple months ago. So, you know. <laughs> <laughs> All right. You head on board uh, and uh, locate the uh, hyperlane that will take you to Frezia. And you punch it into your ship. Uh, you can have your astromech droid help you with astrogation. Plug in. Cheese. I like, pull one of my, uh, you know, my little tools out of the side, and it pops open. And then a bunch of credits spill out at the same time. I'm like, ah, ah! I try to like scoop them up. Really fast. <laughs> Push them just all like back this in. one little claw extending, yep. like trying to pick up each little chip. <laughs> I, I, lo I look back to Seeker as I put my last one in. The little claw goes. Out of way. Where'd that droid get all that money? I don't need. Good droid. Been with me for a long time. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm also going to be, um, when I'm in the computer, I also want to be scanning for ships that might be looking for us or signals or, you know, anybody who's reaching out for codes or anything. Mm -hmm. uh, you can do a perception check using the ship systems. Okay. Is um, it use computer or just perception? This would be a perception using the sensor. Okay. Meanwhile, it will take you 10 minutes to calculate the jump um, since there, you, it's a no, known location and you have an astromech droid helping mm -hmm. you chart this out. Mm -hmm. uh, you will not have any penalty on this check and in fact you will get a plus 5 to it. So pilot check or pilot please, roll? Yeah, please make one. Plus 5? Plus 5. Ooh, uh, that is uh, 31. You're All in. Completely complete this action in 10 minutes. Sweet. Meanwhile, I swear a lot. Standing different. around, using all your equipment. I rolled a one. Oh. What is a 12? <laughs> 12 is not bad. Could be better. Um, yeah, as you access um, your sensors. Um, I'm counting money at the same time. It's fine. <laughs> <laughs> droids can multitask quite well. Yes. Uh, you're a strong independent droid, right? Who don't need no. Boss. Mm -hmm. Boss? Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Partners. Who don't need no Jedi? I don't know what's happening here. 
uh, you have a lot of money. It takes you a little while, but then you remember, oh, your sensor sweep's done. It's pretty standard. Uh, plenty of Imperial ships in the system, um, but you can easily make this jump. Sweet. Before any of them take notice of you. Sweet. All right, we're going to move our map here <gasps> to our landing zone. It's a sweet populated bar. <laughs> yeah, that's a great amount of minis, Sam. <laughs> it's a cantina scene. You have I, to have aliens from across the I galaxy. Totally, <laughs> I totally agree. Oh, I totally agree. Oh my goodness. Whoa. How did I not notice this before? <laughs> I came to sit down. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah. Heck yes. Y'all crazy. You got this, Casey. So this is landing zone on Frezia? This landing zone is on Frezia. You okay. arrive on the volcanic island. And you will land around here to disembark. On our terrain here. Sweet. And what's the feel of the, uh, how packed is this volcanic? Is it uh, impeding my little wheels at all, or am I? Pretty yeah, you're you're kind of struggling to like get. There's all these little pebbles, and they're getting like wedged in there. You have to spend like a moment uh, activating like your your sequencers to like push out all these little rocks that are getting jammed in there. Um, I may just choose to activate my jets if it's gonna keep getting uh, yeah. sand everywhere. Gross. Um, and I'll, so I may uh, I may just float. <laughs> yeah, uh, becoming quite proficient over the years with these little. Uh, Jets that you've installed into your legs, uh, they fold <laughs> out and begin yeah, yeah, to why? fly. <laughs> <laughs> Water comes out of the thing. I just want to say how easily impressed I am. Look, it water. squirts like a little bit of, of water out, and I'm like, ha ha! Clap <laughs> <Have> your hands! <laughs> Magic exists, and it is here! That's supposed to happen, too, right? Yeah. That would not spring a leak right. or nothing. I believe uh, it is, yeah. Okay, good, good. This is, yes, this is where um, your intel has told you that there is an entrance into this facility mm -hmm. where you will not be detected as easily. Uh, all of the, uh, the minerals in this canyon uh, make sensor sweeps very, very difficult. Uh, so you should not be protected if you go this way. We should still uh, approach this tactically. Seek a cheese. Form up on the right. Dice. With me. Copy that, Wick. Right. Eyes and ears open. Let's move. Yeah. So, how would you like to move through this canyon? Do you just strut along? Uh, no, I think oh, no. I think us two are going to uh, kind of uh, stealthily dash to that cropping of b b boulders on our left, and we'll get them to uh, form up on the uh, b boulders on the right side there. So you're gonna split up? Yeah. One, yeah, we're, we're gonna we're gonna split up gonna because split we all have range. Yeah, yeah. Weapon rate. And comms. And We're comms. Gonna hide behind so, rocks inside of each other. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. So, Yava, <laughs> and who are you going with? Me. Dice. These two? Yes. Yeah, maybe behind that rock uh, down. Next one, uh, below. That yeah. one? Yeah. That yeah. one? Yeah. I'm yeah. trying to get over here. Yeah. Yeah. You're just gonna move over there? Get them to move up on the other, on the rocks on, yeah, right. Yeah, just in parallel. So we're yeah. right yeah. across from the We're going to kind of yeah, go through that exactly. like canyon on the yeah, side yeah. there. Okay. Kind of slink through the rocks. Just moving along. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, why don't we get perception checks all around? Well, I use something. <laughs> so perception check is like the dice plus the perception. Is that right? Correct. All right. 24. 29. 22. 13, which is not enough. <laughs> <laughs> 29. 29. Very good. Um, you hear some chatter coming along the canyon walls. 
Go. Where? Oh. Yeah, I'm picking up something. I'm picking up something. Is it like a radio signal, or is Jeez, it like? You're also picking this up. So you and Dice are like, um, if you'd like to try and modulate your own mm -hmm. thing to try and tap mm -hmm. in there, we mm -hmm. can use you. Uh, if you use computers, okay. um, you can try to catch onto the signal. Sure. Um, or if you use your mechanics check, you can try to alter your antenna to like hack into their signal. I will use computers. And I'm also going to try to run to see if I can fill in any words and languages I know that might um, pop into those slots to make that sentence make sense. And I will go to a uh, 33. Amazing. Uh, you quickly recognize the signature of this communication as Imperial <gasps> as you mm -hmm. hack into their comm channel, their open comm channel. Right, I can't believe we're in this backwards corporation world. It's so boring here. Nothing ever happens. Hey, shoot that rock over there. No, that other rock over there. You missed. Are we all picking this up, or is it just like? I'm just translating. Yeah, she's for so she can like scramble like, it, unscramble it, and then relay it back to us, so we all hear what. Yeah, what it saying? seems like they haven't noticed you yet. Oh. Do we see them? Imperials already here. They're early. I thought there weren't supposed to be any Imperials here. It's all right. But they won't be here for long. No. Agreed. How do you want to do this? What do you think, Sika? I can take him out. I just need to consult my very long list of rules. <laughs> 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 um, I'm going to say... Uh, I say up close, quiet. Yeah, works for me. I like that. Up close. They're, That's they're firing sh shots out here, so we can get away with oh, a, a, oh, yeah. a couple. But are they doing like? Are they having like target practice? Yeah, they're trying of? to shoot some rock. You're not even sure what rock they're talking about. Like, but they're back to to us though. Yeah. And what's our range on our? Our weapons, sorry, I didn't, for some reason I don't have that here. Yeah, uh, so you have 30 squares of range for your point blank shots. Uh, so point blank range means you can make a uh, blaster shot without any penalties. Mm -hmm. uh, if you go further than that, uh, so like trying to target something back here, that's going to be your medium distance. Mm -hmm. um, and it's going to t give you a minus two. But they're in like point blank range with us currently? Currently. Oh, yeah. And is they that, have not noticed you. Is that rock between, like, can I, can I get over that rock? Like, can I aim from that, from that rock, or are they blocked from me? Like, would I have to step out to the left? So these rocks are currently giving you uh, full concealment, even though it doesn't quite look like it. Mm -hmm. um, you can, like, lean out, and, like, you see them, and their rock would give them full concealment if they were at the tallest part of it. But where they are now, you can see half of them quite clearly. So this is an effect half cover for them. Mm. 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 Could use my dead eye. You're skilled at picking off enemies with with well aimed ranged attacks. If you aim, deal extra damage. So yes, because they haven't noticed you yet, you could initiate combat with a surprise round. Mm -hmm. so Doing this will make sure they are flat footed, meaning that they will not receive bonuses from their dexterity to their defense. Also, oh. can I do multiple feats, or is it yep, just one? Unless they say they don't. Nope. I have cunning attack, which, which could also work for this. Mm -hmm. uh, which is you gain plus two uh, attack rolls against a flat-footed enemy or one who is denied its dexterity bonus to its reflex defense. Right. So you, if you get the jump in combat or one of your allies does something to demoralize them and make them flat-footed, mm -hmm. um, a situation in which they would not benefit from their dexterity, then you would get that bonus. Uh, so, yes, indeed, by making this surprise attack, mm -hmm. you could. Okay. And I could also use, I have a lot of things that are very much about this. Mm. Please feel free <laughs> to use careful the shot. entire board. It is all open to you. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, As it is open to me. So, I would... <laughs> that sounds like a threat to him. <laughs> hmm. Okay, I would like to sneak up 
to the tallest part of the rock that they're behind on the other side. I'm trying to like double back a bit and then move forward so that you stay in your line of sight. Exactly. Okay. Um, and then uh, when they make a move uh, or, or when, when they attack, I'll be right there to spin out on the other side when they assume full cover. I want to be there, uh, uh, ready to attack. So you go up against the rock that that right where they are, kind yes. of thing. Yeah. Okay. And when, I guess I could go around this other side and like, if well, like if we're going to coordinate, like one, two, three, go. Yeah. As you guys, like you guys can get into position. I'll stay there, hopefully, and then on one, two, three, go. I can just rush in, start gunning them, and you guys can come around the other side, mm -hmm. start gunning them. Yeah, well, what about I aim for the one furthest left here, the one that's lower down, yeah. aiming there, and then you guys uh, aim for the other one. If you want to, if you want to go with melee, mm -hmm. you just don't want to get in the way between. Right. I'm doing the ranged attack. True. You do like the pincers maneuver. Yeah. Come around the both it sides. It won't be melee for me, but it will be up close. Oh, okay. I'm good up close. Same. Oh yeah, I shoot. How are you? I shoot people in the face. Okay, your plan formulated. So we're starting with going to try and get around. Mm -hmm. All right, it'll be a stealth check okay. to try and get around. So it'll be... Alternatively, you can create a distraction so that it will keep them away. They're already looking away from you at the moment, but keep that in mind. Mm -hmm. uh, it'll be my skill bonus plus D20. I'm not adding anything else. Nope, it's already ready to go, all oh. added. <laughs> Let's do it. That's a nat 20. Oh, Ooh. that'll do it. So with your bonus, that's a total of? 27. 27. Uh, this guy's you. You easily make it around. And where are you trying to get to again? Uh, so the, the rock that they're up against, you get right, right yeah, on, on the tallest part, right there. You want to get up here? No, I'm going to stay behind it. OK. When you sneak, do you go ding, 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 ding? As you get to your new <laughs> position and you hold, make a perception check. OK. That is a uh, 14. 14. My perception is good, but those rolls have been not great. <laughs> mm. I feel like you've spotted something. Mm. 14. What you can see is more troopers walking towards. And you see them calling out, and you can hear on their comms, ah, that's not how you shoot. You do it like this. Bah, bah, bah. There's now a circular hole around where the target is. You can see that there's a rock that's like kind of out of the rock face here. Gleams uh, a bright metallic color. You know that this is probably one of those minerals that they were talking about, jamming sensors. They're trying to shoot it, and they've made a nice little hole around it. <laughs> so they're hitting it everywhere but. Everywhere but. OK. They have not noticed Typical. you yet. OK. Uh, I re 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 relay uh, how many more uh, bogeys that we have, the comps. Jeez, can you create a distraction at the far end near the pipe? Keep the next level of baddies away from us. Uh, yeah, totally. I'm here to help. I beep away to you. Um, yeah, so I'm going to need to stealthily go in behind rocks, you know, like get to a rock and then be okay. stealthy about it and then move to the next rock. So I don't know if you want to do this in waves or do one to get me all the way. We want to head to the water pipe. So you want to get all the way back here? Well, I want to see close enough so I can spot it to make sure there's no one else up against there that I can't speak. Do you want to use it. your jets to try and get over here? Yeah. Okay. Stealth check. Oh, guys. Real good. It's good. <laughs> I was stressed out there. <laughs> It's 34. 34 is excellent. Some stealthy little bot. Stealthy little droid flying through the air. You engage silent mode and the jets go silent. <laughs> as you get yourself up onto silent a vent. Silent mode. A bunch of cotton into where all the credits are jangling. <laughs> <laughs> you hear. As you get up there. Something's odd. Um. 
And for a second, you swear it's somewhere over in the far distance. <laughs> Excuse me. Bless you. Uh, <laughs> you see um, almost like a, a glint, like a flash of light. And you get here, please make a perception check. 21. 21's very good. You see that? More troopers are converging oh, on this target practice, this makeshift target practice. I uh, not noticed you yet. Can I quietly can see relay over comms? Reloading their guns after having not hit the target. <laughs> <laughs> Am I able to be quiet enough to do the, my beeps over comms? Uh, if you make a stealth check. To do stealthy beeps? Stealthy okay. beeps. Stealthy beeps. <laughs> 37. Pretty stealthy. Beeping away over comms. No one else can hear you but these three. And that's a count of uh, two more, two more. Hey, you still got those, uh, those grenades? <laughs> you hear like the uh, very quiet beeping chuckles? <laughs> yes. <laughs> grenades. <laughs> As this is happening, um, you see that these ones are going to move Oh, up. I thought he was going to grab two more. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Not yet. And in their place, you do indeed. Oh, oh damn! No. See more. Yes, the number is getting a little heavy. Back. Full drill, full drill! And they begin to move up. Uh. <laughs> it's getting a little rich for our blood. Yes. We're supposed to be in and out. All in, in one spot. We might need to go a little quiet. Well, there's all, they're all in one spot. Are they all in one spot? I can't really see. No, Where not really. They're all spread out. Well, you know. If we could uh, lure them all to one spot but, and just barrage them, but they're quite spread out. How, do we know, like, a previous experience, how, like, squishy Imperial troopers are or not squishy? Have we I had mean, any experience fighting them with them before? They're not clones. No, they're not clones, yeah. Over Say the that. years since mm -hmm. you've been in service, mm -hmm. you know that the Empire has opted to spend less and less on their military forces protection. A I mean, garbage and they're armor. not clones. Uh, yeah, just relay, go over the all around. I'll go over the comms and be like, how do we want to do this? We want to do this hot or cold? I think we gotta do this cold. We came here for a specific purpose. This is not the purpose. Yeah, I kind of, at least maybe we can get like, I feel like I'm in a bad tactical position kind of out there in the open at the moment too, so. Retreat, retreat. You, you feel like your intel was bad. Um, yeah. The Imperials are here two weeks before they're supposed to be. And there's no sight of that private security company anywhere. Right. What else did this guy get wrong? How bad does the information go? Yeah, yeah, it's true. We, we have this much we can adapt. I say we go in cold, quiet, easy, around. Let's go. Yeah. Good plan. I like it. Stealth checks all around. Is stealth like a skill, or are we just rolling the it's 20? A skill. 26. <laughs> 25. Oh, there it is. Never mind. 25? <laughs> <laughs> it is alphabetical. 10. <laughs> oh. All right. Uh, da, da, da. I tripped on something. <laughs> uh, 22? Uh, 22, okay. Um, yeah, you all begin to enact your plans, and taking a step... Uh, dice, you step on a rock... It doesn't immediately crumble under your weight, but you realize it's some sort of pumice. As your foot goes through it, you hear this mm -hmm. and suddenly everyone is perking up. Did you hear that? Could just like hit the deck. There's nothing living on here. There can't be anything out there. You check it out. No, you check it out. We'll draw lots. You see them beginning to get closer. Gotta check a coin. As this one turns <laughs> and notices you. Oi, weapon's hot. Uh, I open up on him. Let's see 
a surprise attack. Cool. And then we're going to all roll initiative. It looks like hot it is. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Cue the fight music. Yeah. Uh, okay. So that'll be uh, the b b bonus on the attack for the heavy blaster is my oh crappy roll. Dex mod, right? And I get to re-roll my. So I believe. Uh, yeah, it should say in uh, initiative. It is a skill. At the top of your sheet, there should also be a little box where you put that initiative. Right. Um, I don't have that box. Okay. Then if you have, if you go down on your skills list under the I, mm -hmm. it'll say if you're trained in it or not. Right. Okay. Cool. 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 So that is seven, and I'm not trained in it. So that was uh, seventeen for my initiative. Good number. I thought so. Hmm. Can anyone beat a 17? I have oh, 25. Are we all rolling initiative? Mm -hmm. Please. I used my improved initiative. Um, I can okay. probably beat a 17 unless I just roll total garbage. Oh. <laughs> uh, 19. 19? It's pretty good. Dice. I rolled a natural 20 plus 12, so Ooh. 32. Whoa. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, okay. You might crush stones. Make noise, give us away. I still had some like hut sliva <laughs> sliding around like It is in your day. boot. I couldn't see your where I was walking. Just sliding yeah, in my foot. foot it was like it was in my boot and my foot kind of went <laughs> sideways. And I was like, ah. Oh, oh, gross. It's in your socks for sure. Oh, gross. <laughs> gross. That's so gross. <laughs> okay. So, we're going to start with the surprise round. Yep. So that, I think we're going to have a break. That attack will be... No, damn! <laughs> Not 20. Ooh, beep, beep, beep. Um, Incredible. That's, that's 3d8. And Doubled. I, ooh, awesome. Okay. Uh, that'll be 12. Um, so 24. Four, and uh, can I use my um, attack and damage rules? Uh, so I get a plus one on uh, attack and damage rolls with ranged weapons. Is that calculated in, or is uh, that... it's both attack and damage? Or yeah, is it just attack? for a point blank shot, the feet point blank shot. It's it says for attack and damage rolls with ranged weapons against opponents within point blank range. Okay. Uh, you would roll, let's say plus one damage or plus one damage die? Plus one damage. Okay, so 26 total on your crit. Awesome. Uh, please explain this execution. <laughs> um, yes. Yeah, uh, so he goes, hey, weapon's hot, and then I just spin out and <laughs> like, like kind of like b blaster like uh, set to the body, turn, turn my whole body, boom. Boom. And from out of this rock, you peek and s shoot him straight in the head as his helmet goes flying in one direction. And he topples over. You hear a scream from the other trooper. And we're going to take this break. We'll be back ah. in ah. five Oh my minutes. goodness. Ah. Thank you, Sam. This is dope. That's fighting, dope. Al fighting already. Oh. Welcome back. We are beginning our fight, our first fight against the Empire in a long battle. So, with a crit on initiative, up first we have dice. Sweet. Uh, okay, um, in, at the edge of this canyon on my side here, is that, can I, do, can I get cover in there as well? Right here, yeah. Was that like, would I get? Yeah, you'd get a cover bonus Full there. concealment, so yep. to speak. Uh, okay. Um, Unless they angle out, yes. Where are they? They're all kind of right in the middle there, eh? They're all kind of here. Uh, yeah, okay. Um, let's go with... Uh, I'm going to do... Okay, for... So I'm going to use my full round action uh, and do a dash and blast where I can move twice my speed and make a range attack 
range, is it both my attacks? Can I make so, both my attacks with yes, my you pistols? Can make both, so yeah, as you move, and because you also have like uh, the move and attack feature, yeah, yeah, you can do all Running of this attack. kind of broken up. So you can run out of your cover, take your shots, and then run and then again. run back into cover. Okay, yeah, I'd Great love to. Great tactic. I'd love to do that. I'd love to just kind of make my way halfway. Yeah, here, pop yep. out. You can see pretty much any of them if yeah. you want. Yeah, uh, I don't know. Ones at the back might be at that short range where you'll have a minus yeah, two. I'll just, Everyone else is. I'll point go one. for the, the the closest guy that I can see. Right here. Yeah. Okay. And uh, pew pew. First shot. Let's take it so away. Just to, ooh, yeah, ooh, knew I was ooh. gonna hit that thing. Uh, <laughs> so what do I got here? Uh, to basic and then base attack just that plus the base attack is added to our roll. Uh, oh, geez, that was nineteen plus 30, 20, 32, 32 for the first. And, and this is with the minus twos for your hit? Oh, no, hit. okay, no, yeah, put, uh, yeah, as, so 30 even. Okay, 30 um, even does hit, roll your damage. Uh, that's 3d8. Uh, what's that, uh, ooh, that's good. Uh, 14, and then plus base attack is 13. No, okay, so dice. just the 14? Yep. Okay, 14, 14. For the first one. Okay. Uh, yeah, you, you you hit him like right in the clavicle, and as he hit, he goes back. Uh, you notice that there's the armor did not protect him at all from this. As he's like, Aah! it seems like uh, he's a little worse off than he was. Not looking so good. A second shot might finish second him. Second shot, uh, and rolled a hit though. Yep, rolled yep. a hit. Uh, 26. 26 does hit. Uh, Finish this guy off. What's this? Uh, 15 points of damage. It, he just kind of startles back, and then as he's reacting to his first wound, a second one pierces through his hand and hits him in the center of his chest. Oh, nice. Taking him down. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and then, yeah, just finish my movement and just get up uh, as concealed as I can be. Yeah. All right. That's your everything. Yeah, that's everything I got that time. Perfect. Moving on to our next one. We have Seeker. Okay. Uh, At the back there. Do I have, between those rocks, can I aim for those? It is going oh. to be difficult for you. Okay, so Depending I don't have a clear shot. Pick, um, remember, these are giving a little more cover than the actual, they're about the same height as everyone here. Mm -hmm. So uh, as you're shooting through, it's going to be difficult to pick off some of them, but I do see you can take a shot at this guy. They'll just have a bit of a cover. Okay. Um, all right. Because I totally know what I'm doing, but I'm going to walk me through this entirely. Yep. Um, would they be considered flat footers? Yes, because they have not gone. Mm -hmm. You have that advantage on them. They are flat footed until they go in initiative order. Okay then I am going to take uh, my time and aim. I'm going to use Deadeye. Okay. Um, so we'll yeah, deal instead of moving, um, and you use two of your swift actions to take aim, yep. lining it up uh, with your uh, blaster carbine. Mm -hmm. uh, standard model, the DC-15A. Kept it up over the years from the Clone Wars. Yep. Looking down the, the scope, mm -hmm. you take your shot. All right, so with three D8s. Uh, nope, uh, you're going to roll a D20. Oh. Okay. And then add the bonus there uh, for a single attack. So the attack mar marker up here? Yep. All right. So nice. I've got 20. 20 total? 20 total. Does hit. Even with all his bonuses, just get some. <sighs> Roll your damage. And damage is the D8s? Or... Yep, underneath there, it mm -hmm. it'll say... Oh, okay, so that's the three eights. Yeah, and because you took your time to aim, you mm -hmm. get one more. Oh, right, okay. I'll have to roll one a second time. Okay. It's only three. Okay, I've got seven, seven, seven. All right, so 21. Whoa! Whoa. And then Whoa. Jeez. a four on top of that. So <laughs> Your 25. little droid friend spews out some credits and then pulls them back in before they actually <laughs> leave. <laughs> you are the devil. <laughs> so 21 plus the last last die there was, was four four so 25 all together yes aiming this up perfect mm -hmm. snipe this one square in the head Bam. as they fall over 
Not even seeing where the shot came from. One. That's three. <laughs> Meet your maker. <laughs> okay. And that's your turn. All right. Jeez. That's you on this ridge. Oh, man. Looking um, down at the action. I'm so proud. Um, <laughs> <laughs> uh, how far can I make it with my nine fly hovering from where I'm at? So that's six. Nine gets you here. OK. Um, and do any of these, this shrubbery up here offers me any cover? Shrubbery. Uh, Am I able for to? Cover. So if I wanted to distract them, I'd make them all turn around, you know? Mm -hmm. So if I wanted to blast, blast with my, uh, I have a little blaster, not really caring too much about if I hit them or not, um, but then that I'd be able to duck into the shrubs there. Do you have attack and move as one of your? Uh, mm. I don't think so. So without <laughs> no. that feat, you won't be able to move, attack, and move again. Okay. You'll have to use your movement speed to get to where you want. And then and attack. Then attack. Okay. Um, what it, could I get down to behind that rock? Down here? Yeah. And uh, still, yeah. I think what I'll still want to do is get somewhere where I have cover, but then fire shots sort of behind them and hope they turn around. OK. Yeah. So what I'm going to get you to do is you'll move in there. And then I need you to make a stealth check to create a distraction. 23. 23. You open up one of your little ports on your side, and out comes a little blaster as this little holdout <laughs> blaster pew, pew, start, fires a shot behind them, not really directly at any of them. And as this happens, uh, you see that several of them turn around. Uh, amazing. I will yeah, over, to me. over the comms, I'm just uh, letting everybody know I'm okay. Good Thanks, to know. Thanks, <laughs> Okay. Interesting. Very interesting. All right, we'll go up to, not Yava, but... Uh, Wick, Wick is going to, um, uh, if he's not already, shift over into half cover there, like to the, the smaller side of the rock, just to get a, a kind of... Yeah. So having right? half cover will also give your opponents half cover. Yes, um, that's fine. Um, and I'm going to... Uh, I'm going to open up on the on the one that's uh, di directly in my line of sight. Okay. So that is my move action and my standard action, right? That's uh, been taken so far. So you've used your movement to get out, and then you're going to... Yeah. Yep. Okay, good. I'm going to start that attack. That is... Uh, that is 25 to hit. Uh, 25 to hit uh, this guy over here. Yeah. This one you can see, because this one is concealed from you at the moment. OK, then just like the, the closest one I can see then, yeah. Perfect. 25 does hit. OK. They are still flat-footed. Yes. It's like they rolled one or something. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. Um, Right, and I want to make sure. Or something. Think of your little buddy. What was his name? <laughs> Mr. Romfrat. Yeah, what was the Romfrat's name? Who? Your oh. dead pal from your deceased um, right. It was Spot. Thanks, Empire. <laughs> <laughs> it, was, it was a Womp Rat named Spot, and not because it had spots on him, but it left <laughs> spots everywhere oh, along. <laughs> Not housebreak, not really housebreakable. No, he was, he was the worst thing, but yeah. he was the only thing I had. What is your worst thing? <laughs> no. Woo! Okay, uh, <laughs> 23. Oh, what's that? 23. Uh, damage, I rolled quite good there. Uh, and that is, um, uh, oh, 
can I use a, a rapid shot on this guy, or how does he look? So you have to declare rapid shot before you start attacking. Okay, then I will not. There are negatives involved. Yes. Uh, got it. Got it. However, please describe to me how you take this one out. Um, kind of in the same same way, just like uh, like so I. Spun out, took that guy out. Uh, a few more guys get uh, t t t taken down, and I just roll around the, the tall side of the rock to the, the other side, and I on the first target there. Um, so I've used my movement and my standard. Can I use can I use my uh, swift action to enact commanding presence? Uh, you do have a swift action, yeah. Yes. Cool. Uh, so, well, once per encounter, I can activate this talent as a swift action. Until the end of the encounter, all my enemies within six squares take a minus two penalty to their will d d d d d defense. Okay. Uh, yes. Uh, do you have to be able to see them? It does not specify. It does say within six squares. Okay. So, these two right here yeah. uh, in blue are within six squares of you. Okay. So I'm going to say that uh, after I take uh, their, their uh, uh, friend, friend out <laughs> behind, uh, uh, behind them, uh, they, know, they, they know who I am. And they're like, oh, no, right. it's him. Yeah, you, <laughs> you can see like, the one that you killed like, was reaching up to their con didn't quite make it there. Yeah. Uh, you hear like, a, a flurry of like, commands going back and forth. Um, it seems that these are just soldiers perhaps none of them are leadership worthy uh but that's your everything standard yep. swift and movement so with all that said it's going to be their turns uh mm -hmm. starting with the one over here gonna reach up to his con we need backup backup how much do can we can i tell if the crystals in the area block any of that the crystals are currently blocking scanners so they don't but know. they don't block any of the comps okay good Correct. to know Okay. So you can, as you found out with like yourselves, you can communicate yeah. with each other. Mm -hmm. um, you've still hacked into their open comms, uh, and it looks like they've switched comms. You don't hear any more comm chatter now. Those jerks. <laughs> oh, they realize their open Wi-Fi channel. was not so good. That said, <laughs> you could still try it. to yeah. get that. Oh, wait, don't tell my turn. Um, the password was yes, password. Exactly. Um, so you hear them calling for backup, and you hear the sound of very large metal doors, Durasteel doors, opening up. Mm-mm. Oh, and a <laughs> sound begins. Ooh. But none of you can see this yet. OK. Great. Cool. That sounds <laughs> awful. <laughs> no, that's Thanks, I hate it. <laughs> <laughs> so this one's going to go. Um, it's going to run over here and try to make an attack on you through half cover there. Okay. So, Wick, getting the first attack against them, this trooper runs in and fires. Maybe, maybe not. 19 to hit. That's your reflex defense. My reflex defense is 25, so 19 does Good. not hit. This thing hits into uh, one of the rocks in front of you. Um, so you would have a plus two uh, bonus to your defense from this. Um, and it does not hit you. Uh, so he's going to use the rest of his movement to get over here, but not quite into cover. Uh, then this one's going to come out from around here. Uh, I'm going to move significantly. So you still have half cover, so that plus two. Uh, and it's going to get to that position and then take a shot at you. And you see like uh, its battery pack powering up or from its backpack as he pulls out a very heavy weapon and begins to fire several bolts in your direction. Got it. Cool. <laughs> I can see it. Yeah. 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 I can feel yeah. it even. So. 22 is not quite enough to hit. 22 is not quite enough to hit, no. A second one is going to come in and do the same thing. And make Yaka this Baba, a coordinated Yaka attack. 
This will be a 30 to hit you. That is a hit. Okay. So, as these uh, several bolts come just hurtling through the air towards you, you go to try and defend yourself, and you get around the first ones. The second ones eat through the rock in front of you and hit into you. Well, this was fun. Yeah. <laughs> Good game. Good game, guys. <laughs> this is going to hurt a lot. Uh, as the heavy uh, guns hit into you, you take 34 points of energy damage. Okay. Whoa. What is your damage threshold? Oh, my damage threshold is 24. So this surpasses your threshold. This is a grievous wound as you m fall one on the condition track as well. Okay. I'm going to mark that down here. <laughs> <laughs> so that's minus one on everything? Yes. Uh, everything that's stated. Yeah. Defense, As you attack, fall further skill. down that track, you'll begin to increase your minuses to your abilities, attack rolls, and defenses, as well as eventually your speed until you are helpless. Okay. Well, such a great feeling. Yeah, that's awful. Um, and you said that was... Uh, I took 34 points of damage there? 34. Okay. Um, yep, yeah, I'll allow it. <laughs> okay, do you have <laughs> any reactions that you can utilize to defend yourself? Uh, I do, uh, but I... But they're not applicable here? I, uh, one is applicable here, Okay. but I think I'm going to allow it because I can only use it once. So I'm just going to... Let me check one quick thing. Did we bring stim packs for you guys? Uh, I guess I, I have uh, uh, the, the damage reduction feat, so uh, all, all damage dealt to me is re reduced by one. Okay, that's very good. Yes. You, so that's, that's that helps. Dope. Every yeah. little bit yeah, helps. Yeah, 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 that's cool. Hey, uh, at the end of this, if you have one HP left, you know you did your job. Right. Did job too so it says at every even numbered level after second, your damage reduction improves by one, D DR2 at fourth, DR3 at sixth, and so on. Correct. That's for the elite trooper, so your prestige class. Got it. So I'm only level two in that. Right. So uh, it's just Someday. minus two. On the road. Yep. We'll get there. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> I said we'll get there. Okay. I have faith in you. <laughs> I, I'm placing bets against everyone's survival right now. <laughs> you hear and feel shaking in the ground oh, no. as a rumbling comes through this valley or this canyon as rocks begin to tumble down from the top parts. No. A no. What large ah. enters into the foray. It seems that they called for substantial backup Oof. as it moves. The intel was really bad, guys. <laughs> I, I say in, to the comms, oh, but they, they must have heard I was here. <laughs> That's all it can do, though. So we're going to enter our second round of combat. Dice, take us away. Oh, jeez, I can't even see. Uh, hold on. Uh, OK, uh, can I? I can hit the guy with the heavy weapon, that big blaster that was shooting at uh, Wick there. Is that possible? From my my current position, so you're looking to shoot the guy. Uh, one two, yeah. You do have the unique perspective of being able to see that you have a shot with three quarters cover here. Three quarters it's going cover. to be tough. Uh, so that you would know is a plus five to there. To how think. many guys are ex left out there? This one out here is one. Uh, in the open. If you dart out, you'll be able to get him or him. I don't really like to dart out anywhere. Uh, Is there three remaining troopers? There four. are four, four? remaining troopers. Oh, okay. okay, so there's four. I got some hidden okay. behind a rock for me. Okay, yeah, yeah, I just can't see from here. Uh, I would like to move. Uh, yeah, can I actually get up on that, that the, the narrow side of the same rock that Wick is on? So you want to? Will that give me a? Move yeah, will that give me a, a, a decent shot at uh, the other guys? Yeah, I, yeah. Because if you move and attack, you would be able to still attack before you finished your move. Yeah, yeah. I guess I could do. I'll, I could just keep using that move. That's a pretty good move, actually. Yeah, it's dope. 
Yeah, I'd like to do that. Uh, I'd like sure. to, uh, or maybe I can kind of get to the front side of that rock, take aim at um, the guy with the big blaster. The, bl the two with yeah. the blaster packs? Yeah, 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 yeah. Using and the then at blasters. the end of my move, I would like to get back behind, behind the, in the cover that Wick is on kind of thing, or is on. Okay, under. yep, okay, so you're gonna come out, get a better angle of the yeah. way you come out, take your shot, no, uh, no covers based on the way that you can do that, and then move behind the... the that right is here. what I would like to do, yes. So we'll start by going like this, out yeah. here, and then you'll be able to duck back in, so make sure. your attack roll. Oh, 19, 32, uh, no, sorry, it's two, isn't it? Because dual weapon mastery, so 17, uh, nine. that's yeah, 30. It's only minus two because that's a yeah, 30. but 30. 30 definitely hits this big boy. Okay. Uh, Roll that damage. 38. Roll it up. First shot. Roll big. You. Oh, yeah, that's uh, uh, 21. 21's pretty good. Yep. Okay. Uh, he reels back in pain as you uh, have pierced his thick armor uh, as he's like checking his weapon really quick and then seems to tough it out. Um, uh, for the second shot, I guess I'll, I'll just, yeah, shoot the same guy again. Right. Get him. Get him. <laughs> Trying to get him. Get him, get him, get him. Hit him, hit him, hit him. Yeah. Hit him. Second shot. Second shot. Yes. Uh, t uh, 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 23. 23 does hit him. Okay, great. Thicker armor, but you're still rolling well. Uh, uh, seven, uh, 14. I mean, you should. You got us into this mess. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is all your fault. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Stepping uh, up some pumice. Jeez. Getting some hot tail. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Hey, what? <laughs> When it, when it comes to you, you know. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, 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 what is that? Uh, 14, 17. 17? Yeah. Good number. Uh, yes, yes. Yeah, you, uh, you hit him uh, again, and this one, uh, you see like one of the uh, plates of armor just flies off as you hit it, uh, and you can see like a little bit of a scorch rune as the carbon scoring from your shot digs into him. He's still standing. Still standing. Oh. He's tougher than the other ones. Okay, and then I use the rest of my uh, to my duck away. To, uh, yep, right yeah, in here. Get back in there. Okay. Great. I think that's that's it. your turn. That's all I can do. Seeker. Okay, do I actually have any still in my view from here, from where I am? Ooh. From where, where I'm looking, it doesn't look like it does, but I also can't see all the. People. It is very rocky along here. Okay. Your sight line is not great. It would pass through Wix space, but you, I believe, have a feat that negates that. Yeah. Familiar foe? Uh, friendly fire? Mm. Like something, something that allows you to not hit your friends. Oh, is that precise shot? Is that what that was? I think it I would I do be, have something, but where is it? It would be the <laughs> precise shot feat. Right, yeah, you're right. I have that one. Okay. And I also have um, running attack, so. Perhaps it right. Find so it. if you take your time to aim because of your your abilities, yep. it will negate the cover bonuses. Okay. So you could shoot this one. All right. It's just a tough shot, but if you uh, turn your movement into a swift action again, and use both of those to aim, and then you take your shot, I think you got a good chance there. Let's do it. Okay. So this is precise shot, um, and then I'm using. I'm gonna aim. Great. Okay, so I'm doing a 20. Roll a d20, okay. add the attack bonus on your sheet there. Oh, uh, On your weapon. It's nine. Um, so this is, this is a precision roll I'm doing, or is this? Uh, it should be you know, the higher, the higher uh, plus on your sheet next to your weapon. Yeah, yeah. I'm just uh, saying, what is this type of roll here that I'm doing? An attack, a ranged attack roll. Oh, okay. Yep. So I, I rolled really bad. That's okay. <laughs> Sometimes your bonuses make up All for right. it. Remember, got, you're ignoring geez. cover. Yeah. Six. I've got 16 in total. 16 in total. Yeah. Oh, no, sorry. That's so I've got 18 in total. 18. Yeah. That's still pretty good. <laughs> Definitely enough to hit him. <laughs> You're yep. used to like taking those hard shots, lining it up, 
taking a breath, holding, and then firing exactly when you need to. Even though it's tough, you still got it. Roll some damage. Uh, because you aimed, you can, uh, with mm -hmm. your feats and stuff, you have four uh, damage dice on this. Okay. Hey Sam, I was, I was forgetting with my trusty sidearm, oh. I also get plus nine. So that last hit would have been like, what's, like 23. Plus nine? So this is a trusty sign of plus nine damage. Damage, okay. Yeah, not to hit, but Let damage. me add that to his damage. Yeah. More uh, armor falls off. Okay. So okay. Delayed effect. Got it. 16 in total. 16 in total for damage? Yeah. So many things to remember. Yeah, you, uh, you, as you take your shot, uh, you see that it hits him in his uh, uh, gun hand, like like right through the arm, mm -hmm. and he seems to be just clutching it and like trying to like see if it still works, <laughs> kind of struggling to make it move. This armor is worth nothing. I'll get him. Quick, get him. Yeah, you're looking looking good. Good shot. Um, they're just about to double over. Uh, as we move down the list, we come to our droid companion. Cheese. Um, obviously, I see the walker come out and a couple of credits fall out of my butt. Clink, <laughs> um, <laughs> clink. Oh, no. um, I want to spring load fire my thermal detonator at his feet. <laughs> uh, okay. Um, I just want to get close enough that I can do that, but maybe not be visible by that stormtrooper who's so over there. So it's currently nine squares away from you where you are, plus some elevation, uh, which would be a minus five if you stay where you are. But if you move closer, um, you can certainly get there. The problem is you won't be able to move back into cover. However, all that aside, where you're currently positioned, because it's above, firing down on you, your cover is different and mm -hmm. almost non-effective from where you okay, are. Okay, so I need to move anyways, is what you're saying. Is, it's is very it, dangerous to stay where you are now. <laughs> is there <laughs> any way to get behind that really big rock um, while at like, you know, thermal detonator and then land where I have that big rock as cover? If you fire one from where you are now with the minus five, you could. And then to get behind the rock, you could move there without any problem. Uh, it's just your swift action won't be able to turn into a movement action, so you'd be locked into. And would like, I know, would I know that if the thermal detonator hits him, like even at his feet, but not super high, if I can, would it blow out his feet? Um, Do I have an idea of whether that would work or not? I'm I'm doing this hail mary regardless, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> you you know that thermal detonators are especially effective against flesh and blood targets, uh, not so much against vehicles. <laughs> okay. okay. Do you got anything like a rope you can nope. tie around his legs? Can I you? got. I have neurotoxin grenades and a thermal detonator, and I I came prepared to kill people. Yeah. Which is sort of my jam. Um, Damn. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I mean, using di uh, neurotoxins like dioxys is uh, a very effective way of taking down flesh and blood targets, but mm -hmm. highly mm -hmm. illegal by the, yeah. the <laughs> Geneva Convention. Yeah. Yeah. The war crimes. Well, what planet um, is Geneva? <laughs> <laughs> There's a Genova, isn't there? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so maybe this is not a great plan. Um, it would do significant damage. I would, I'll, I'll let's, mm -hmm. yeah, it will still damage it. Right. However, it's not going to stop it would, from like, being able to fire. You know, it would vaporize most of these troopers. What? You know, it would vaporize like the troopers. Right. So, so never, never, never. What if I? Is there any chance it's going to hit Wick? If I threw it into the middle of the whole thing. Oh, around. So like where you're sitting here. Yeah. You can't see anything. And if around. I went closer to the guy, like between, like on like the, this other side of the rock, on the other my side of it. Uh, like this one. Or yeah, here? like like in there, that little hidey hole, and yep. then lobbed it into the middle of all the guys. So with nine squares, you could move, but you would have to get rid of your cover bonus. So like, yeah, you can like move through the little thing here and then end up over here next to everyone and kind of like lob it here and, and hit them all. Yep. But doing that, you would be exposed. To the guys or also to the walker? To the guys. Um, yeah. That only affects you. can't get you if they're dead. 
Yeah. They can't yeah. get to you if they're dead. <laughs> Correct. Uh, I'm going to do that. We'll, okay. we'll, we'll throw the detonator in there and then hope that my buddies can deal with the walker. All right. You're going to go in here. Um, so you're going to be able to hit all of them if you hit your grenade in right there. Yep. Please make no pressure. A ranged attack roll. No pressure. Uh, this is against their reflex defense. And it's one attack roll and all of their defense. Oh, it's really high. <laughs> Yay! Um, 34. That Wait, is 33. an incredibly well-placed grenade. <laughs> Just th the focus in this droid as they like drift over their little jets and land themselves. Look out. As the thermal detonator explodes, please roll 8d6. Yes! Six. <laughs> what? <laughs> All sixes. Now understanding why uh, C-3PO freaked out when uh, yeah, thermal detonator. Play in disguise pulls out the detonator. <laughs> Whoa! Uh, Twenty-six. Twenty-six damage total. Okay. So vaporized. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that that that's the only one, huh? Oh no! I'm not mad at it. <laughs> 26 damage is substantial. Mm -hmm. um, and then you see like those two troopers, um, uh, the heavy troopers, their thick armor protecting them uh, a lot better than the other ones, but it seems like they're shrugging off some of this damage as well. Um, they were not vaporized by this blast. But? But they, one of them looks <laughs> pretty darn hurt. <laughs> so there's still three standing? There are. Three troopers, two heavy troopers, and one regular stormtrooper. Right. Is the regular one the one that I hit, or was that one already? No. Uh, the one you hit is dead. OK. All right, so I don't have any in my line of sight anymore. All righty. Uh, currently, the one who's, no. who's seriously regretting his decision for the trash armor. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> one who's rethinking his uh, choices at the career fair. Yeah, yeah. There's <laughs> no choice in conscription. <laughs> <You're> just, <laughs> This is the way. <laughs> Not at all. <laughs> uh, this okay. Is the way. Jeez. Vaporizes one. Wick. That means it's your turn. Okay. Get him. Um, so. Getting pelted with some shots here. You're uh, staring down two heavies. Yeah. Story of my life. Weird. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Come again? Whoa. <laughs> Moving on. Yeah, uh, I am going to... Uh, that was the uh, cantina. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna, um, <laughs> let's see here. I'm going to use uh, my... Um, I'm going to use my r r r rapid shot against them. Okay. And uh, two so shots. I can make two quick shots uh, as a single attack. Correct. Using, let's see, when using a ranged weapon, you may fire two shots as a single attack against a single target. So, uh, which one of these guys looks? The one that's uh, in the middle there? Yeah. Looks real rough. Yeah, it'll, it'll be him. Um, okay. Yeah, the itchy trigger finger, like, pow. Yeah. Quick shots, <laughs> rapid shots. <laughs> Lick them off. Uh, so it'll, is it just one attack roll or do I? It's one attack roll and, and then you add a damage die. Got it. So that is, uh, is it good? 20. Woo. 20 total? Yes. Ooh. Unfortunately, because of the, the rocks that are in the way, uh, you fire off your two shot and it impacts into one of them, hitting the cover. Shit. Oh, wick. <sighs> Alas. That is your standard, so you are able to move, and you do have a swift action left. Yes. I don't know Those of you firing blaster shots, don't forget to track your ammunition. It's you will need to reload at some point. How many? Um, how much? Ammo Thirty on your pack. Yeah, but how many? How many do we expend per shot? If you're taking a single shot, each yeah. single shot is one. Okay. Um, something like rapid shot that would be count for two shots. Yeah, I didn't take rapid. Or if you're shot, taking right. multiple t attacks with one shot each. Then that's two so shots bang, there. So ba bang, ba bang. Yep. Your carbine is different. It has fifty. I took four. Okay, that's what I thought. Okay. And I've shot two things. Their okay. their blaster pistols, or okay. yeah, their heavy blasters each carry thirty shots. Okay. With their power packs. And that's you guys would know you can 
use up some of my energy mm -hmm. to refill. Oh, cool. Yeah. Yeah, just oh, plug sweet. into the port on the droid, you know? <laughs> We're all just oh. like plugging into you like you're a cube tab. Yeah, yeah. And I, I age, like I'm just yeah. like... Ah, ah. Yeah. We've progressed to USB 9000. <laughs> right. Uh, plug so, it in one way, flip it over, plug it in. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's always the first time. It's not very compatible with my yeah. blaster. <laughs> uh, the long my, port. my move action... Uh, yeah, you're... Oh, you know, I can... Uh -huh. I can make an additional attack during a round of combat uh, with pistols. Every time you, as a standard action? Uh, or is it just once? It doesn't, it doesn't say once. It just, say, it just says uh, I can make an additional attack during a round of combat. Oh, what's the feat? Double attack. Right. Uh, so that would be, each of those attacks would be at a minus. Right, so it'd be minus five, right? right? So you'd have to declare that before so that you factor Got it. it in. Okay. But that's okay. So, cool. I'll keep that in mind for next time. Um, right, uh, which means I will... If you want to get full concealment, taking a few steps back into your little hidey hole there... Yep, that's, what, that's exactly what I'm going to do right now, yeah. Okay. Back behind the rock, they cannot target you there. They would have to try and move in there somehow, and it's not easy or, at all. Or blow the rock to pieces with an ATST. <laughs> but who would do that? <laughs> Can I pick the? No. <laughs> <laughs> We're so hard. <laughs> uh, all right. Yeah. Unfortunate miss. It's the way it goes sometimes. Yeah. Reinforcements begin to pile out of. Oh. Ah! Night. This is it, huh? This is this is how we die. Yeah. This is. We didn't well, make it very far, guys. The scientists are just like right inside the facility. You yeah. know? They're just on the other side. Hi. Yeah. The scientists are like, I mean, I could help, but you know, I'm a scientist. Yeah, so. who has time? <laughs> yeah. That's what happens when you listen to a, a senator with ideas and a general who... Sam, did you bring us here to one. die when we land? You monster! Was this, was this general wash-up? Did no one make perception checks to like see if he was telling the truth about everything? Uh, we believe everything he says! I was covered in hot spittle. <laughs> <laughs> fair, fair. Uh, so they pile out. Uh, we're going to get some movement, because you're all well concealed now, except for, oh no, our little droid friend. Uh, he can't target you right here easily. So he's going to actually back up and get his friend to turn. And they're going to make an attack on you, one each. Uh, is the dodge only on my turn? Oh, right. As a free action, you can declare one of them as your dodge target. I'll let you do that now. Um, also keep in mind, because you're a strong independent droid, once per <laughs> encounter, you can use your reaction to add four to your defense test. Yes, I have independent spirit. <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> uh, so the first attack is a natural one. Woo! Oh. I don't dodge that one. Blew it. Yeah, you see like, it. like them like holding up the uh, the heavy blaster, and it just kind of gets away from them for a moment yeah. as they like shoot up the rock face. Couple more credits. <laughs> <laughs> Lucky droid. Second attack comes your way. It's going to be a 30 total. Oh, great, because I will be independent and dance a little bit. Um, <laughs> Adding four to your defense test. Add four to my 29, takes me two. 33, Woo! Heck yeah. Again, like this, this one seems more like ready to hit you fully. And then as it's about to hit, your like logic program suite initiates your defensive rolls and your jets ignite as you fly up into the air, shots follow, and then you come back down gently landing. Very nicely done. What kind of okay. noise do you make? <laughs> nice, well done. Uh, I agree. I wish the system had like, inspiration doesn't really <laughs> unless we play a long campaign then you can get like destiny points and stuff <gasps> like that but we don't I have totally that saw the force flash before my <laughs> my sensors <You're> programming? <laughs> <laughs> i am programmed for metachlorians <laughs> <laughs> okay uh big boy's going to go mm -mm. get some movement here he's going to move up 
Just crash right through those bodies. Uh, and seeing you, because of, uh, both of you are in its range, it's going to make an attack against the two of you. Uh, using its big cannons, they fire in a two by two grid. Mm. So it will hit both of you with this attack. I mean, or, you know, maybe it'll miss. It has to roll first, yeah. <laughs> we, we guys, we didn't know we were bringing blasters to uh, an AT fights. Yeah. An ATT yeah. fight, yeah. Well, we'll see. So as it, uh, as it turns in, and you can see up, seen looking down at you through the visors of uh, this tank, this ATST, as it fires a shot, 26. Um, uh, which one are we? Sh reflex defense. Do oh. I still have plus two from cover? You do not. G got it. Um, 26 just hits. Just hits. Do you have any reactions to add or anything? I do have a reaction to add. Um, I don't know if I declare it before or after I take damage. It's but a reaction, so you'll be able to increase your defense if this is the case, or... It is a uh, delay d d d d damage. Okay, so as you take the damage from this shot, you can choose to shrug it off for one round. Well, not really yep. shrugging it off, but like delay it for a round. Yep catch up with you a little bit later. Okay. Uh, so let's find out what that damage is. I'm going to tell you it's significant. Uh -oh. oh, I'm missing one. <laughs> <laughs> a monster! Uh, you're going to take 36 points of damage. That's actually kind of low. You lucked out. Uh, remember, if you beat your threshold, you're going to fall back on. How long can you delay it for? Until the end of my next turn. So yes. So if you choose to do that, you'll delay that damage until it hits you a little later. Yeah. OK. So we have more troopers entering the battlefield. Uh, we're going to go up to dice. Um, coming up on our break here. So let's get uh, it. OK, uh, I would. So how many new troopers are moving in? I can't really see from here, so. Uh, you've got three new ones that have entered. Three new ones, okay. Um, They've like, opened up a door in from the facility. And have yeah, I up. would like to, okay, I'm going crazy. I'm going to <laughs> use my dash and blast again, come around the corner of the thing, aim at the two guys shooting at uh, Cheese over there. Okay. Uh, maybe one shot each if I could. So you're going to come over here? Yeah. Shoot. Can, can I, uh, now, uh, how much movement? I've got six, but it's. Yeah, so you can use three to get out and three to get back. Is this is there something that's double, that it doubles my movement? Oh, from like the, the charging one? Yeah, I thought I had something that doubled my movement. I just, my notes are scattered. Okay, you uh, still have enough to get like into uh, firing range and then get back into cover. I don't want to get back into cover, that's the thing. Yeah, because you're not really got cover from the No, <laughs> yeah, we got to yeah. deal with uh, problem number can we, can one, we which is... Can tell where they're coming from? Double uh, This is the back of the facility. Okay, so we know there's a door that they're coming out through. Yep. Okay. Does inside now, we can get inside. Question. Does the dash and blast where I use a full round action, mm -hmm. does it pair with running attack? Uh, it should, because you, that one just allows you to make your attack as you move. Okay, so I can... Come out. Shoot. Boom, boom, Do you have a jetpack? Keep going. Oh, you have a jetpack. Okay, yeah, I'd like to move. Uh, I'm going to just... I've moved three out. Yep. Yeah, okay. Uh, I'm going to take, yeah, I'm gonna take a couple shots at those uh, two troopers that okay. are... Okay, take them out. ...harassing cheese. Uh, yeah, 15 for the first one. 15 does not hit. No. Even, uh, yeah, even though its back is turned to you, you just like, you're so startled by this tank, you go wide. Okay. Uh, second, second attack. Second attack. Oh, man. 17. 17. Good number, good number, good number. Come on now. <laughs> okay. And again, like, you just, you're kind of like frustrated from your first shot that you don't make a second good shot as it also goes wide. Oh, okay. Uh, I'm going to, man, it's not good right now. So if you move double, then you'll have nine squares that you can move total. Okay. Uh, yeah, but then don't get any more, I got no more. That's it for that's yeah, it? nine. And that's the end. Uh, sorry, I can't see. You know what? Back with it. I'm, run I'm going to get up to the foot of the ATST. Oh, no. 
<laughs> what? What? Oh, what? Yeah. Whoa. What? You got a blind spot, don't I'm they? Get right up. If I can get right up underneath it, I will. Okay. If it's anything uh, like video game logic, there's a blind spot. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Yeah. Exciting. Okay. Dangerous. Uh, yeah. I'm worried how this is going to turn out. But okay. we'll find out when we come back in five <laughs> minutes. <laughs> <laughs> and welcome back. Uh, thanks to 3B Radio for sending in some raiders. Welcome, raiders. Woo. As uh, we continue our Star Wars story with our old clones and their one droid companion. They're stuck in a perilous position now, facing down an ATST in a ravine uh, in the middle of this canyon. Doesn't seem good. Uh, so, uh, after Dice bravely rushes up to the feet of these ATST with a plan in mind, we go to Seeker. Right. Okay. So, what do I have in my view right now? Just the ATST? Yes. You can see it. It can see you. All right. But it's got pressing, more pressing matters to attend to. Right. Okay. So, perhaps I can provide some suppressing fire. Okay. Yep. Yes. This is possible. Suppressing fire. Suppressing fire. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, you can use your, uh, uh, you can use a, a standard action to start just pelting down the area. Okay. Um, giving a minus two to other people's attack rolls in the, in your arc of where you're shooting. Um, so would you like to move before it or you're happy where you are and trying to just like distract this tank a bit? Can that tank aim towards me? Like can, would he be able to hit me from my cover? Yes. Okay. Because he's up. So remember, this is a huge right. tank. It's towering above the battlefield. Your little cover is perfect for all the little troopers that are trying to get at you. But this thing has an angle on you. Right. OK. So could I use running attack? You move as you attack. When making an attack with a melee or ranged weapon, you can move before and after the attack, provided that your movement is not greater than your speed. Right. So your speed is 6. So yeah. you can move any amount of squares of that and make an attack any time along that. Uh, and then finish your movement. Is it six to get behind that large pillar, kind of to like my right? Here? Yes. I'll need you to make a jump check to get up there, but it okay. is possible with all of your movement. Jump, yes. And I also have a, something to do with jump. Jump. Are you trained in jump? jump. I am trained jump. in jump. Okay. But I had a special that. ability with jump. I'm trying <laughs> to. That, I'm not gonna... uh, so oh, that's a die for cover. Okay. Let's uh, roll okay. for your. Um, Make your jump check. The DC is nine. Okay. Nailed it. So I have plus eight, 20. 20, yeah. I mean, being trained in jump, you're, you're used to like being able to just push off and get Whee! to where you need to. Yep. Quick motion, combat trained, you're ready. And as you do this, you make your attack against. Yes. Uh, and you're going to use it to do like, uh, like a distracting, like suppressing kind of move. Yes. All right, yeah. And you just start like hollering at the top of your voice while firing your gun off in wild directions. Suppressing fire! <laughs> That's amazing. <laughs> uh, the tank definitely notices you mm -hmm. uh, and turns its attention your way. Mm -hmm. uh, pretty good, pretty good. We're going to move on to, cheese, our little droid friend, CH33Z. Oh, <laughs> baby. Uh, it's not looking at me. But the two troopers are. They sure heavy are. Troopers. Yeah, the two heavy troopers dodging their first attack, round of attacks. You don't know how much longer you can hold out, but maybe you could take one of them out. They're looking pretty rough. Uh, I think my flamethrower probably can. <laughs> Heck yes. <laughs> <laughs> All droids um, should be equipped with flamethrowers. Yeah, yeah. So the little top, the little panel on the front of me just goes, Psh! and yep. then uh, yeah, my fire out like a little T shape yeah, going exactly. down onto them, and as it plumes out. You make one attack roll with your flamethrower, and it's going to just engulf them with flame. Oh my god, that's huge. Uh, 32. Hmm? Oh my god. Yeah. Woo! Please roll your fire damage. As, uh, uh, as these heavy troopers uh, try to like put their large blasters in front of their faces, even with their helms, they're feeling the heat on this. Oh my gosh, it's not that great though. It's only six damage. <laughs> six damage. <laughs> <laughs> it was a really impressive fireball. It's just like, you know, licking at the edge of their uh, <laughs> the radius of hitting them. And the gas has a really Yeah, you see one of them uh, just begins to like put out all the flames and they seem more concerned with that uh, than anything else. Uh, this is hurt. <laughs> uh, the one that looks the most hurt uh, is nearing the end. 
Uh, am I able to move? Yes, you have your movement and your swift action. Mm, what are my options with swift action? Uh, second wind, which will heal you if I don't think you take it. Don't need that. Uh, um, I'm good on that front. You could start to recharge your shield generator, but again, you haven't been. I'm good hurt. on that front, yeah. So I don't have any options that are really available to me. Not on at the switch. moment. Okay, then I will um, hide my clanky little butt. Okay, where are you going to move? Back, forward? Is this would provide you the most protection. I want to stay hand. as far away from the line of sight of the ATSD. Okay. So, so popping up your little flight uh, yep. jets. Engage those jets. You bury yourself behind this large rock. It's going to have to really come around for it yep. to try and be able to I'm going to put my little, I got my one little claw hand and then my un, my little slicer tool, and I'm just going to hide my eyes, like, <laughs> shake a little For a little bit. miracle. No, no droid noises? Wow! <laughs> 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 yeah, it's like, yeah. oh, God. <laughs> Over the cons, you're like, uh, we've, I don't know that one. <laughs> yeah. uh, Wick, you're up. Yeah. Um, so... Uh, I am going to jump onto the rock there. Okay. Um, uh, this one's a little higher up if you're going here. Otherwise, you can jump here for DC 9. This one's looking a little tougher. How much more? Uh, you, I'm going to set the DC for you at uh, 12. Cool. So not like a ton more, but enough. Yeah, yeah. I got you. I think I, I make it automatically because my jump skill is 11. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Boing. Okay, yeah, you get up on top like of this rock. Flip. But I want to see how good it looks, you know? Let's, yeah, yeah, yeah. let's do it. Roll for That's flavor. a nat 20. Oh, my oh. God. Roll for flavor. Did you just like... Something up acrobatically, <laughs> uh, using your jetpack to assist you as you twist in the air uh, and you, you come onto the rock, superhero landing, looking up at this tank like you're going to take on the world. Right. Wick, you're so cool. I'm all right. Uh... <laughs> the the two heavies are are in my line of sight now. Two heavies are in your line of sight, as is the tank, as is the new troopers that just entered the battlefield. And there's okay. One other, there's one other jerk. Cool. Down there. There's uh, one little guy here. Hmm. That guy must have soiled his pants so long ago. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. What is going on? <laughs> Reaction. I'm gonna activate my jetpack. And uh. It, would you say that the top of that ATST is six squares uh, away from me, or less? It would quick, be quick just at the here. edge of it. Yes. Hmm? It would be just at the edge of it. Yes. But you know that with dice running in and having operations run before, he's gonna blow this up. Fair. Uh, then, <laughs> uh, then, <laughs> cool, cool, cool. Uh, then I'm going to uh, uh, land on the uh, that. Really tall pillared rock there. Yep. To get a nice vantage point there. Tip back control. Yep. Arc trooper days. Yep. Getting back on top. That was nice. one of the days. And then, uh, <laughs> so that was. All your movement. That's all, all my movement, and I've taken a swift, I guess? Uh, did you take a swift to jump? Yeah. Cool. Uh, standard action. The, the most damage heavy. Okay. Open up. Looking bad. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Uh, I'm going to say that that is, um, let me see, is it? Uh, I'm uh, going to give you a plus two situational bonus as well, based on having some sniper vantage. Okay. Uh, and they're the, on fire. And, then, <laughs> and they're on fire. Yep. <laughs> Chemicals, it smells, uh, you know what, you lost your smell a long time ago. Yeah. <laughs> Not on the battlefield anyway. D d d double <laughs> attack um, on that. To choose a single, blah, blah, blah. Okay. When you make the full attack action, you give me make one ad additional attack, and it's a minus five penalty on attack, attack rolls. Right, but you can't make a full attack because you've used your movement and your swift action. Got there. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Then just an attack. Standard attack. Yeah. Let's go. 23. 23 with uh, the situational bonus. Oh, 25. Five, right. And did minus, you... minus one because my condition is down. Okay. 24. <laughs> no? So okay. crunchy. Uh, did you do what you did before with your rapid shot where you get you fired two quick shots at a, on the same attack? Yeah. Okay, so that would be a 22 actually, which does hit, but you have awesome. extra damage that. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. And that is 3d8. Eight. 
Well, how many? 13. 13 damage yes. total. Yes. Please explain to me how you fly through the air and kill this enemy. Awesome. So I'm going to uh, just like activate my jetpack. It's like just second nature. It's like riding a bike. Uh, I'm going to soar overhead. And as I land, I'm just going to spin and bow and hit his battery pack. And it Amazing. blows up. Sweet. Yeah. Yes. As, like, as this like strikes a perfect strike, you've done this maneuver many times throughout the Clone Wars. And even though your body's aged a bit, you still feel that muscle memory kicking into place as you execute this maneuver, exploding him. And you deal a little extra damage to the one next to him awesome. as this explosion happens. Nice. Awesome. Very well done. Flash damage. Nice. Take that. OK. Um, my so. suppressing fire, how many shots would that have been? Uh, if it doesn't say there, it's between 5 and 10. I don't think it, anything says about that. OK. Oh, it's and at the end of that turn, probably I Probably 10. Because, okay. um, because it's just a wild firing. You're I'm not hurt. like making an aimed attack. Yeah, I'm hurt real bad. Uh, so yeah, we'll go with uh, minus 10 ammo for those shots to get minus two to its attacks. Okay. Huge. Awesome. Okay. So incoming. Uh, Wait, what? You hear a chatter on the comms, an old frequency that you three have not used in about 15 years. <gasps> As you hear over this channel, I NEVER GET TO DO THIS! Woo! As a droid ship crashes down. What? <laughs> crushing both the tank and one of the troopers. Oh. As it falls, you just hear... Oh, damn it, Wrecker, you're not supposed to yell the whole way down my ears! Uh, as... Wrecker? From up above. <gasps> Several clones appear. Our compatriots. In strange armor. <gasps> As you would know from the old days, even aged, Clone Force 99. <gasps> what? 99? <laughs> and this is going to be a wrecker crushing down. As the tank explodes. Like right in front of me, too. You right? hear. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're just like at the end. Of the like, oh, what? <laughs> As uh, shots ring out from a sniper, uh, as you hear three bodies hit the ground, uh, as one more of them appears down here, presses a button, and you see the power pack on the final heavy trooper explode. Wow. Right, boys, clean it up. You see that all of your enemies oops, have fallen as the Bad Batch makes their entrance. Sweet. Whoa. Sweet. And who the hell are all you? Well, yeah, we uh, had it handled, but thank you for your assistance. I would say that we are well pleased. Once you get that armor. You. We earned this armor. You only earned those armor. Maybe we all earned this armor. Uh, you see that we one take of off them our takes helmets? off the helmet yeah. and he's got a red bandana that's ragged and completely covered in sweat stains. Nice. Uh, yeah, uh, I'll take off my helmet. Like a clone to you. Yeah. I'll take off my helmet too. I do too. Yep. So they know that we're clones. Hold off. Unreal. Looks like there are a couple more of us left around after all, eh? What are, the what are you regs doing here? Regs. How did you escape the order? Regs. We yeah. all have our own backstories. <laughs> <laughs> we don't have time for a seven page backstory right now. <laughs> could say the same. Because we're all here for the same mission though, aren't we? Right, but we're here under the orders of Saw Guerrera. And you three? Uh, we got some uh, bad mon, intel. Mon Mothma. Mothma. Yeah. She doesn't get anything done. Her intel wasn't spot on, that's for sure. It was awful. You see, like, Wrecker, like, stumble out. Can we go again? <laughs> <laughs> like, comes up to you, Dice, and uh, just, like, slaps you on the back, and you're yeah. a little taken aback. Uh, yeah. Thanks, big guy. 
<laughs> yeah, you see um, the one known as Tech like coming over and like trying to piece together. Well, we'll get this one off the ground again. Too bad we found this on Duxon. How long have you been here? The ride is busted too. Just got here. Really? Did you see our ride? It's quite impressive. <laughs> It's just like What's exploded your? all the bits around. <laughs> um, uh, Wick says, uh, wait, 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 wait. If we're here on separate orders, what are your orders? Well, we're going to steal the Star Striders known as X-Wings. Uh, the successor to those Arc uh, 170s. Right. And we were still... Steal the X-Wings, too, weren't we? Well, we're also taking some scientists All but a friendly us. bet, then. Uh, Whoever gets to it first gets to keep the prize. No fighting between us. I hear, I hear them say the word bet, and I just, like... <laughs> <laughs> and then I kind of come, like, wheeling out around the corner, and then I turn my little ch because the sand's all in my, my, my feet anyway. Yeah, so. Hunter, like, takes an E to you. All right, little one, bet accepted. And he shakes your hand. Your little hand appendage when it comes out, your claw. Okay. Right. We got a deal. The scientists we're are We're going to go this way. I don't know what way you're going, but we're going through the front door. And you see record, oh, yeah, and just takes off at full speed. You know what? I wouldn't mind uh, a more direct approach here today. They oh, do so make we're a just going to follow them, ram. or we're going to go through the sewers like we planned. They've already left, so they're not listening to you. No. <laughs> <laughs> I have um, a little slicer tool out, and I just go Look, if they make a big enough distraction, we can get our job done in record time and have enough time left to, to grab an, an X-wing or two. That big one's a big enough distraction as it is, let alone the other four. The, the right. scientists are our top. So let's, let's stick to the back route and get it done. Back to cold. Sounds good. Back to cold. <laughs> <laughs> we'll approach the, uh, yeah. the duct. Let's go back to cold. Going to the sewer duct where uh, General Dodonna gave you information to make your way inside. We're gonna need our expert master slicer, cheese, to hook up to the port there, wheeling in. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna use have, make friends with this computer. Yeah, oh, so show. Let's, yeah, let's make friends first. Uh, so your first check is going to try and bring its attitude down. Still use computer though, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, so 32. Incredible. Uh, because oh, I should be rolling an advantage on this. Yeah, that's right. Oh, it was much better the first time. <laughs> <laughs> with a 32, um, because of your uh, natural slicing abilities, uh, you're able to hack into the system and turn it from being hostile towards you immediately to be friendly. Sweet. So now you're able to control the flow of the water coming out as well as open the grate. Am I able to get a sense of anywhere else in the system that I could direct water to or cause problems for the other team? Yeah, if you stop the water from flowing out, the wastewater in that uh, flows all like the heavy metals and scrap out of the facility will stop and then begin to build up. Great. So, with that said, um, stopping the water could cause some problems. You're also going inside, though. Mm. You estimate that it would give you about 40 minutes once you get inside? Yeah, let's do it. OK. Sure. Water stops. We're here to live dangerously, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> Raise the grate. <laughs> You're able to enter into Incom's facility here. But we will switch our map out. Oh. Do I get a, a map of the facility while I'm with the computer? Yes, you do. Sweet. Is it the same computer that runs through the entire facility? Uh, this computer is only restricted to certain parts. Okay. You'd have to hack again once you're inside to get a Kay. more substantial uh, information center. If I get a little help here, thank you, Casey. Amazing. Beautiful. Yeah. So 
you find yourselves going down a long corridor after a wet ride. Ew. <laughs> <laughs> this was nothing like the hut. Look at me. Is it just, uh, your boots are just more squishy, huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, you're, uh, I just dried these things seeker. out. Sorry, there we go. Enter into this hallway. Uh, and as you're going down, you hear a klaxon go off and the door shut behind you. Oh, jeez. You're pretty sure this is because the Bad Batch just entered the other side of the facility. Yep. It They're took the alarms. Down. Yep. And right. uh, is there a computer terminal on this side, Sam? Um, there is. And as you go to approach it, you hear the marching of feet down the hallway as you see a large force of stormtroopers enter through. Have they seen us yet? Take it took cover. Stormtroopers. <laughs> Are there any? Are any of these? Uh, are there any blast doors along this, or anything that we could that I can slam shut, or is this just like an open hallway with some beams? Uh, this is a classic Star Wars corridor. <laughs> <laughs> hide into the side and pop out and try to hide back. Maybe you'll find a little chute. In fact, as you do a quick scan before we start our combat, you see a little droid access hallway on either side of this uh, this corridor that you would be able to get yourself into. So, that's it. We're going to roll initiative, and hopefully Casey will be back to stormtroopers. <laughs> no, don't do that. Please <laughs> no. no. Three don't do it, Casey. Whose side are you on? <laughs> <laughs> initiative. Much better right. initiative. Roll. In the box, in the box. Initiative. <laughs> Thank you. Ugh. I'm gonna re-roll this. <laughs> yes. Better. Much better. <laughs> okay. Have you guys been able to heal yet? No, we didn't attempt to heal. The okay. second wind. Also, the time that it took you for, to get from the other one to get in here, you could definitely take a swift action to second wind. Awesome. Heal up! What? You heal half your total? Is that what it is? Second wind? You heal one quarter of your hit points. Quarter, okay. As a swift action, some of you can do it for free. <laughs> okay, initiative rolls, please. Starting with dice. Uh, 27. And Wick? 26. Oh. Jeez. 30. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> There's that droid superpower. Uh, oh, wow. That's actually. An independent decent. little droid. <laughs> not as good as everyone else. 27. Also a 27. Is that a dex? C goes first, who's got higher dex? Uh, who has a higher initiative bonus? Initiative, I got 12. Ooh, Seeker, you're going just before this. Sharpshooter. <laughs> Guys, don't mess around. I'm ready. This one's cheese. Ooh. Great. <laughs> okay, so. Matt, the game. <laughs> uh, They're running down the hallway towards you, uh, and we're going to go first with cheese. I am looking for this droid panel. Yeah, you quickly see it. It's right beside you there. Um, uh, you begin to move over to it and notice that it will take you a, oh, because you have the slicing abilities, it will be a swift action to open that with your used computer skill. Great. Do you want me to do a check? It's 10. Yeah. <laughs> I do it. I do it. <laughs> You're great. Okay. So uh, you enter into this access corridor here and you see that all along it, you can uh, move and get out through any of the other grates. So you can pretty much move into any of the covered positions that you want. Okay. You can even get all the way behind them. 
Ooh. Or leave everyone behind. I mean, that's up to you. <laughs> there are thing credits on the line. So, uh, <laughs> there you go. but uh, yeah, I mean, okay, so I'm in the tunnel and I will go. Um, I could probably tell where they are, so I would head towards them. Yes. Oh, yeah, of course. Yeah. Great. So we'll see you get to. My movement will maybe get me halfway. Quarter. Oh, Jesus. Yep. Okay. You have nine movement, right? Yep, nine. Yeah, with my jets on. Powering your way down yep. this little hallway. <laughs> Gotta help your friends. Okay. <laughs> Gotta get into position. Get that bag. Yeah. While you're in here, you have total concealment. Okay. Um, however, you tapping into the sensor grid of this computer, you have a good idea of where they are. Okay, perfect. Yep. Seeker, you're up. All right. I'm going to get cover immediately in one of these uh, standard Star Wars corridors. Do you want to take <laughs> a shot first or? Do you want to just get into cover? Oh, good point. Good point. Uh, are they flat-footed? Yes, they have not gone an initiative yet, so uh, they will be flat-footed. Sweet. Okay. And they do not receive any bonus from their dexterity to their defense. Okay. Then I am going to use cunning attack on an unprepared opponent. You gain plus two bonus on attack rolls against flat-footed enemy or one who is denied its dexterity bonus on its reflex defense. Terrific. Take a shot, because they're within 30 squares. Mm -hmm. If you're taking one of the first ones out, mm -hmm. go for it. All right. Uh, anything else? Everyone else behind them will be more difficult to hit yeah. as you go back. So if I aim, I can't move, right? If you aim, you cannot move. OK. Because that will take two swift actions. I'm not going to aim then, because I'm going to move after okay. that. OK. Ooh. Six and. OK, 15. 15 to hit? Yeah. Um, oh, and sorry, which one were you attacking? Uh, the one in the very front. Oh, yeah, so I put the, t the plus two on top of the 15? Yeah. Yeah, that one. Yep. Okay, so 17. 17 to hit? Yeah. Because they are flat footed. Just hit. <gasps> Roll some plus. damage, please. All right. So, three. These. Big numbers. Eight. 13. 13. This facility is just flush with stormtroopers. Yeah, as you hit, on, uh, hit into him, he calls out, Medic! Uh! <laughs> Medic. Yeah, right. He looks a little whippy. Gotcha. Uh, OK, and then uh, you use your movement to get into full cover yes. behind this little here, or do you like move up here? I move up, yeah. Okay, great. You have yeah. old concealment from almost mm -hmm. everyone. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Looking Into the good. Cops, shoot. <laughs> so we move to dice. Okay. Uh, dash and blast it in. I can move. That, make, I'm allowed to, yep. that, that lets me do twice my speed, right? Right. Is that so I can pretty much get to the second row of like bulwarks yep. kind of thing, really? Dash and blast, pew pew. Okay. Let's, uh, <laughs> so you move I'll, uh, full movement, and before you tuck away, yeah, you take I'm gonna, off your shots. I'll shoot. I'll shoot at the the other, the one beside whoever uh, one Seeker was. Looks shooting to be at. in heavy armor. Heavy armor. I'll take two shots at him. Okay, let's do it. Uh, come on. Apply your bonuses Fancy dice. and negatives. Don't screw me over. They are flat-footed currently. Uh, so yeah, this base attack is. Uh, so that's advantage. Uh, oh. uh, their armor bonus is less. Okay, they okay. don't benefit from their dexterity. Cool. Uh, first one would be uh, to hit, uh, psh, that's minus two, 25. Oh, hell yeah. Okay, first one. Uh, first hit. For 3d8. Yeah, not great. Uh, eight, uh, nine points of damage for the first shot. Nine? Yeah. Well, that is a little low for you, but yeah, yeah. Uh, there's got a, another attack there's if you a, want it. There was a one in there. Yeah. Oh, and I, I'm going to, uh, and I will actually uh, shoot at the other guy. That's okay. the other one who's already Wait, taken nine. some. Did you add your trusty? Oh, no, you're right. Plus nine. So uh, yeah. You're right. Sorry. Ooh. Yeah. Plus nine. What did you add? Thank you, Sam. Oh, I've got Gunslinger. Yeah, I got Ooh, trusty so sidearm. Nice. Uh, okay. So with that. They're <laughs> looking not so good. I'm still going to shoot the other guy, though. OK. Uh, oh, 18. 
18. Oh, 19. Sorry, 19. 19. No, 18. 18. Yeah, 18. Either way, they're flat footed. You Great. hit them. Great. Uh, come on, let's not. Go big. Uh, what is it? Uh, 11, 14. Uh, yeah, that's uh, plus nine, 23 points of damage. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. You see this one. Is the guy Spires. behind him just painted red kind of thing? Yeah, like, yeah you just like shoot into him. No, save him, save him! Uh, and yeah, I guess for the rest of my movement, just get in uh, maybe to my... Spinaroo. Duck in behind the, the bulwark. Uh, okay. On to my, uh, your left, I guess it would be. Take cover in there, yeah. Nope. Squish in there. Got pretty good cover. That's Looking it. good. That's me. All right, moving along, Wick. Okay, uh, I am going to uh, find my cover uh, in the bulwark next to Seeker, but before I do that, I'm going to take my shot. Okay. Uh, so, uh, directly down the hall, uh, there's one that's dead, one that's, or two dead now? One dead. One dead one and dead. one injured right now? One dead, one pretty injured, two more with thick armor, and then a bunch of what look to be rank and file. Okay. Um, I'll go for the injured one with a rapid shot. Boom, boom. Two shots from your blaster on the same attack. Gets you an extra damage die if you hit at a minus two. That is uh, 22. 22. Flat foot, it does hit. Okay. So that'll be... Can you do two die. damage? <laughs> yeah, I didn't even roll my, my extra die. <laughs> awesome. So, 19. 19 damage total. Beats his threshold. Yep. He's dead. Yeah. Woo! And I'll uh, take my cover as well. You're going to go right here or are you going to move up? Up, yeah. Okay. Everyone in cover. Looking good. This is the way. <laughs> this is the way. Oh, boys. Two uh, down. Two down. Um, the medic is going to move up and try to revive their commander. This is... Uh, Gotta take out that medic. Nope. Can't happen, actually, because he had to move. So instead, he's just going to stay there because he can't yeah. help. He's dead. <laughs> can't heal him. I've never seen a medic in Star Wars and the Imperial <laughs> side. They're just yeah. like, you just die. Go die. You'll this was it. the preliminary times when they were like trialing the role and then decided it wasn't worth it. Yeah, it's just not fun. It's, <laughs> not, it's not in our budget for medics, unfortunately. Yeah, it's just right. this little thing that's like, coming yeah. up and it's annoying. This is why we've never seen them. They had a couple and they were just like, you know what? Hey, they're just dead, guys. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, big boys are going to move up. 20. And they are going to try and obliterate your covered area. Mm -hmm. By hitting you with an area attack as they spray fire, you are the one that's closest, so they're going to just try and target that area. Please add 10 to your defense. Uh, add 10 to my which defense? That are, those are the two worst rolls I have ever seen. Sweet. Uh, it Great. matter. Okay. Uh, so right. they're just like laying into this. this Suppressing fire. Uh, like, <laughs> just missing. If only. Uh, yeah, they're just like riddling this area with damage. Uh, all of it seems to be centered in the middle of the hallway, though, so it's going to be hard to kind of poke your head out. Got it. But it's fine. Doesn't matter. How many imps uh, does it take These ones are going target? to run, and they are going to move past their allies and get into position uh, all over here, uh, which uses all of their everything. So we're going to move along. Cheese, start off our uh, second round. I am heading towards, I want to get behind them. So I'm just making my way. Okay, so you've got nine squares of movement. Yep. Making your way. So three, eight, this is nine. As you see through the little grate here, there's someone on the other side that is not one of your friends. Uh, I wonder if I can sneakily drop a neurotoxin <laughs> grenade on him? <laughs> you sure can, and guess what? You're a droid, so you're not affected by it. That is right. I don't need to move. Heck I can yeah. just be like, boop. <laughs> 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 yeah, please make an attack roll with that. Uh, against their reflex defense. 
Uh, they will be flat-footed against that because you are totally concealed from them at the 24, moment. 24, I guess, plus 2? 24 plus 2, yep. Yeah. So 26 definitely hits. Roll that damage. This is 3d6. Uh, it's going to be 8. 8 damage. How wide is the radius? It doesn't hit anything. Oh, and they also, this is against their fortitude for the poison. Yes, the poisoning effect. Um, so that was, that does take effect indeed. So they're going to move two down the condition track as they, <coughs> these things don't have filters. <laughs> 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 Who designed this? Yeah, it's just like a bucket. <laughs> just yeah, they're, they're looking like they're choking out. Nice. Even under the helmet, like you're, you're like detecting like, ah, yes, elevated is, heart rate. <laughs> they is in multiples or they is in that person? That person. Oh, okay. Uh, okay, anything else? That's uh, Do you have a swift action in there? Um, quick check. Um, there, is there a ter computer terminal near me? Uh, yes, there are ports all along this hallway, as it is meant for droids like you. Um, cause I can, I can use a swift action to give it a quick command. Yep. Um, so I might, I'm just going to try to see if it can flash the lights, um, just where the stormtroopers are. Oh, okay. So hopefully it'll distract them. I don't know. Yes, um, because that's a different system. You're not friendly to it yet, so you will oh. need to make a... I don't know that I only have the swift action, so I don't know if I can do this all in one go. Computer check. Or light control, we'll say it's okay. okay. But we'll make a check just to see how it goes. You do have roll twice and take the better because of right. your master slicer ability. I'm all so good. Uh, it is 33. Wow, beats the DC of 30. Mm. Do you manage to flicker the lights onto their most intense setting right where they all are? So they're kind of fuddling with it. Seems tough to like kind of see if they're blinded by the light. I know my guys can, can deal with it. They're great. They're great. It's not the weekend yet. Don't worry. Yeah. Uh, okay. Yeah. Excellent turn. Well done. Uh, after cheese is Seeker. Yeah. All right. I'm going to hold my position and I'm going to attack so the ones there are they completely in cover so These this ones? one you could get a three-quarter shot on but because of your powerful abilities you would ignore their cover okay these ones are totally concealed from you at the moment okay um so it would just be this one you might be able to hit him from your concealment too okay it's just it's tough because like there's not a lot to see right because you're also getting that bonus of not a lot to see by being where you are right okay I will aim for the uh, front area. Yeah, that one. That, right here? that fellow right there. Great. Okay. Yeah, um, because you're able to shoot precisely and sharply, uh, mm -hmm. you do not. Uh, you ignore the penalties from the cover. Uh, so make your attack roll. Okay. Um, if I use point blank, you get a plus one bonus on ranged attacks. Yep, that's always active. You're yep. good. Okay. Uh, and yeah, if you, mm -hmm. if you take the time to aim, uh, you increase your damage and all that as well. Yes. Okay. So then be a total of plus three. Yep. Yep. Okay. Well, Since you're not moving. Sorry? Since you don't have to move. Yeah. You're in yeah. A really good okay. spot. 12 plus 6. 23 plus 3 is 25. 25 to hit. Does hit. Woohoo! Yeah. Please go ahead and roll damage. All you right. Remember to add an extra damage die. Yes. 12, 14, yeah, and 17. Just like this perfectly lined up shot, you kind of like use the bulkhead to like steady your aim a little, even mm -hmm. though it's already pretty steady. Fire it off, and this completely unaware, choking, poor guy <laughs> falls. Whoa, whoa. He's a stormtrooper. He works for Nazis. It's fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What if he was just, uh, conscripted and brainwashed into... Oh, you're, uh, you're toast, okay, dude. Okay, we're not, we're not we're in toast. first order lore here yet, okay? We don't have time for that shit. Right, yeah, as, like his, his, his die, as he dies, uh, you see like a little hollow gets sent out. 
props to a family that you never right. ate. This, this <laughs> isn't a TED talk. Oh, 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 open fire. <laughs> open fire. Excellent kill. Dice, you're up next. Uh, question. Um, can I throw explosive charges? No. No? I have, they have to be, like, grenades. placed? Placed, yes. Okay. So well, as I, you saw, like, like uh, Tech must have, like, stealthed in and placed a, an explosive and then got away and blew up that power pack from yeah. earlier? Yeah, yeah, that's yeah. That's kind of what you'd have to do. Okay. Uh, well, that's kind of takes things a little Oh, bit, could have uh, given one to the uh, droid. I'd like to... Next time. Yeah, next time. I'm just going to... Okay, I'm just going to... I'm not going to take the dash and blast. I'm going to just kind of... Uh, and just to move up to that next, uh, this one? no, forward. This one? Uh, to squeeze in with your buddy? <laughs> where, who's there? This one? No, that's me. Oh, that is oh me. no, no, I'm, oh, no. No, you're back here. Right, no. We, we got, got the mini swap. We got mixed up. Yeah. So you're right where we are, but the yeah, minis need to Yeah, that's me. Okay, yeah. Okay. Got it. That's why. Okay. Uh, yeah, I'd like to try to. Are, are those two heavies still pouring fire down the hallway, or? Um, they were shooting here but like you you could get around it now okay like, yeah attacks over uh yeah i'd like to try to okay. get up to that next yeah that okay. one there yeah okay. and uh hopping out and around take a shot at that dude right across from me this one yeah okay uh based yeah. on where you are he does not have cover and you don't either against him no nope, that's okay pew take pew him out a couple pews pew pew uh, uh, <laughs> yeah, uh San -Sma. oh 18 does hit. Okay. Uh, that's four, uh, four, eight, ten. 19. 19 damage. <laughs> <laughs> they're like bracing themselves against it. See you rushing up. Ah! Get shot. They're like doubled over, taking a blaster shot right to the gut. They don't look good. Okay, I'm going to. Uh, Aim another one for. What, he, he dropped his hands down to. Yeah, he's, he's like, trying to like oh. cover his wound. He's like almost lost grip on Shoot his. Shoot him in the face. <laughs> uh, Twelve plus uh, eleven. Uh, what's that? Uh, Twenty. Twenty-three. Twenty-three does hit. Okay. Uh, Especially after taking a minus one. And oh, geez, what's that? Seventeen. Uh, Twenty-six. Yeah, please Point. describe this gruesome end. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, the first one's just gonna go. First one's going in his gut, and he's like, "Oh, I'm just like, oh, it's a man. I ate something fishy last night, and poof, right in the face." You see, like, just like this vomit, right? like yeah, right where their little mouthpiece like, piece area out, is. And as you do, you hit it, and just an explosion of gore, as <laughs> blood and some sort of lunch that was eaten earlier that day. Gross. It's all over the hallway. This so, is an R-rated version. Official st Star Wars edit. And for I still have a swift action. <laughs> Release the R-rated versions. Am I running it? What can I can I like like take a little more cover? Is that a thing I could do? Uh, you or is that... are very well concealed where you are until people move up. Okay. Then it's going to be. Um, tricky. Can I like hold a swift action and like use it to mm, s no. help someone else later or anything like that? <laughs> Does not work. That no. Way. Okay. Yeah. Can not, you use it not, to heal if you need to the... heal? All right, I'm just going to, uh, just If you to... want to stay there, you still have your six squares of movement. Yeah, but that gets, If you uh, want to move back into cover behind you. You know what? I'm going to run across the hallway to the one across. Oop, just yeah. so you can? Yeah, I'm going to do a sweet roll. <laughs> <laughs> nice, okay. The, um, the head of that stormtrooper explode, and I put my little claw hand out the vent, and I'm just like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, uh, yeah, as you move on to the other side, you see, what the heck? Oh, no. Yeah. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> Bloody droids. Okay, uh, we can move to Wick now. Uh, okay. On the back line there. Yeah, I'm going to... across from you. I'm going to move up one bul bulwark, and while I'm moving up, I'm going to take my shot. Very nice. Using your running attack. Pew! Yep. <laughs> pew, pew. You see, like, these, like, two... Heavily armored, heavily outfitted troopers just pelting down fire at pretty much. Attracts. A rapid shot as well. Uh, a rapid shot. Yep, yep. Yep, yep. So yep. Minus two. Blah, blah, blah. Uh, there. What what range would you say that they're in right now? Oh, point blank. <laughs> you don't have any. Cool. You're good. You're good. Yeah, I got a plus one on that. Attack. This map is not big enough for cool. extremes. Okay. 
Extremes. Extremes. Totally. Our new theme song. <laughs> you want to do one too? Coming. <laughs> Twenty-two, big boys, does hit. Okay. Yeah, and that will give me. Actually, it would have been a twenty-three. I'm, I'm good. I got it. Um, okay. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Just want to make sure I'm doing everything correctly for a system I haven't played in over a decade. Um, also, it's crazy. It's crunchy, but I like it. It's fun. <laughs> <laughs> Learning all kinds of stuff, yeah. like math. Right. Oh. <laughs> Math <laughs> and an extra D eight here. Boom! That one's cocked. There you go. And then uh, uh, twenty three points of d d damage. Twenty three points of damage on those two. two. Very nice. Okay. Some quick maths here. Okay. And then you pop back into yep. cover. Great turn. Moving along. Their turns. Oh, hey, dice. <laughs> Grenade coming at you. Oh, what? You see uh, uh, one of the heavies um, pull something out with his offhand. Very strong. Holding on to this heavy weapon with one hand. He tosses a grenade out towards you. Oh, no. Somewhat blinded Kick it by back. flashing lights at all? Perhaps. Perhaps. <laughs> uh, with their attack bonus. 25. And that's total. reflex? That is reflex. 32. Good. Uh, you will take half damage from this uh, frag grenade as right. it comes towards you. Man, a frag grenade in party mode? This is good time. <laughs> yeah. Man. Right? So that would be 19, which is half to 10. Uh, 10. Okay. So nine, apologies. Nine damage. It rounds down. Cool. That's one grenade. How about another? <laughs> how, how about another? No. <laughs> 18. Ah, no, not even close. Uh, you still take half damage. All right. So we, we have that solace right there. Uh, <laughs> So it's 12 half to 6 more damage. 6. These grenades impact and blow. Not enough. Copy Not enough. that. Okay. Um, this guy's going to poke at his head, see nothing, um, is going to take a defensive action. Uh, Coward! <laughs> Top of the round. Jeez. Uh, I want to come up to these guys and poop another toxin grenade. Is that what we're calling it? Yep. Pooping okay. it out? Yep. <laughs> There's no turning back turn, now. Do you turn it? Is that like your back hatch? You turn around? <laughs> Boop. Yeah. So you're going to plop a grenade right here yeah. and hit these two? Or do you want to like plop it a little further out and hit the middle two? Or um, I want to try to hit the middle two. The middle two? OK. Yeah. So you'll have a little bit of a penalty from the guy being right next to you? We'll try. It's going to be a 23. Ooh, their reflex defense is 24 with that. Damn! Oh. Oh. Okay. So does it just not go off? Um, it doesn't affect their mm. um, their anything. They had filters on. Yeah, these ones got the filters. That's yeah. why. These, yeah, like the yep. grenade goes and like it just kind of dribbles over here somewhere and doesn't affect <laughs> anyone. Like, Where did that come from? <laughs> <laughs> I just like close anything the else? little panel back up. Um, I guess I'll. Hmm. I wonder if I can try to convince the computer to sound an alarm behind us or behind them, like back somewhere else around the corner in the facility. Okay. Mm. See if that distracts them at all. There are alarms going off all over. There are alarms off everywhere. Uh, but like I a sprinkler system or something. Responding to one right now, and it's. Up. <laughs> and it's. <up. laughs> can I turn off all the alarms? Yes, you could do that. Okay. Uh, it's still hostile to you, so give me that uh, use computer check. Uh, 30. Right on the DC. So, you turn all the alarms off. Oi! You see them kind of looking around confused. One of them seems to be pushing a button. Nothing's happening. 
Seeker, you're up. Right. Okay. Um, I am going to move up, and I'm going to take a shot while I'm doing that. Okay. I'm going to up here. Yeah. I'm going to move up. So you won't be able to aim, but you will be able to shoot. Yeah. Okay. I will da -da 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 -da. use my did I will use point blank to add plus one. Okay. So this would be eight plus nine. Eighteen. Eighteen. Uh, and sorry, are you shooting the guys out here or are you shooting the guys inside? Um, this guy you can't shoot. He's yeah. Three. Um. So I can can I shoot the medic? You can't shoot this one. You can shoot the medic. I'm gonna shoot the medic. Okay. It was an 18? Yeah. Uh, even without, uh, oh, they did not take their defensive action because they had to do, do some moving. So you do hit them. Ha! The medic. Yeah! <laughs> Just barely. Yeah. Take that. You went to school. Yeah. Yeah. I'm trying to help people. <laughs> I got 19. <laughs> uh, 19 damage? Yeah. Uh, is that with your bonuses and everything? Uh, which bonus? Oh, wait, you didn't do your full thing. No, I didn't aim. Never mind. 19, looking pretty bad. Uh, yeah, you like carefully aim up your shot and you see the medic like poking out to see if like the other two are still alive. You see he's got his like med pack ready to go. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, 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 looks like he's going to use it on himself later. What you get <laughs> going to school. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't make any sense. Just uh, roll okay. with it. Uh, question. Um, like, when I move, can I get past the line of <laughs> troopers? Like, I can't force myself past I them mean, and keep sure, on going? I mean, you can certainly try. <sighs> uh, I'll tell you what I want to do. Okay. I want to yeah, run, there, there's a I wanna run <laughs> through the middle of them, yep. place my charge, okay. and keep running. Okay. Look at his can body language right you now. You certainly can. I, could, I would like to try to do I that. I'm so excited. Okay. I would Me like too. to move. So Sam, did I, I didn't kill the, the medic then. I did or I didn't? He's looking like he's barely hanging on to life. Okay. All right. Uh, so you go and you place your... Can I like back. put it on the back of one of them? Absolutely. I'd Please like make a mechanics check to see if you can set this thing properly. Mechanics check. Oh, I got good mechanics. Oh, uh, and 19. 19. You yeah. will set it. Hey. Please make a grapple check for me. Grapple? Uh, that will be uh, at the top there. If it's not filled out, use mm. your... Uh, I don't see no grapple. Because of... Uh, do you, you have martial arts? No, I don't. Oh, we didn't take that. Okay. No. So uh, add your... Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> I do. Can I make an acrobatic? Uh, Can I make an acrobatic. acrobatics move? And like... Absolutely. <laughs> yep. Of Let's do that. Kay. Acrobatics against oh, their... Uncool. Acrobatics. <laughs> well... Uh, that is yeah, 22. You certainly do. Place it on there. On um, it goes. You keep running through. Yeah. As you do that, they're going to shoot you. Okay. Um, so they have a, an ability to uh, make opportunity attacks with their weapons. So they're going to fire a single shot at you each. Got it. So it's not as severe as some things, but it's going to hurt still if they mm -hmm. get you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 18 does not hit you. Nope. Oh boy, that's a critical hit. Okay. Oh, this is gonna hurt a lot. Yeah, that's cool. So for crits, we double all damage. Yes, double all damage. It's a good thing it's not their full burst. It's still pretty good. So 16 doubles to 32. 32 points. And what is your it's damage threshold? 26, so that drops me to negative one. On the condition. Minus Sorry, one, on. okay, got it. Is, yeah, you turn. You like acrobatically place one. He goes to like turn around and try to shoot you. Doesn't hit, but his partner's already turned around and he's got you dead to rights. As he got shoots it. you in the back as you stumble forward Ugh. and get behind so that's, cover. Yeah, 32 is, what was that, 54. Okay. And uh, yeah, that's- Can you use a swift action what to What was like the uh, timer that you set on it? How long? Uh, psh seconds yeah okay. yeah at the end of the round it's going to explode okay so we're going to go to seeker oh, sorry uh wick okay 
Uh, which one has the dent pack on its back? This boy right here. Okay, I'm gonna uh, open fire on the one uh, next to him. Okay. So, uh, am I allowed to aim? Uh, how does that work? Like, uh, like it, right, like uh, aim and shoot is like a... Aim is swift action and your movement converted to a swift action. So two swift actions to aim. Yeah. And that will give you a bonus on your uh, attack and your damage. I will do that. Okay. And the bonus is plus one, I'd imagine. Plus one, and do you have any fees? No. OK, so yeah. I don't, so we'll just think, I, I don't think I do. I just want to make sure that I Plus I to hit. Precise shot, but that's something else. Also useful. Something else. 17, baby. Number. 17 be... plus your bonuses. Yep, plus my bonuses, so that. Some bab in there. Uh, It's a big number. It's about 20, I, I, 27. 27? Yes. OK. To hit. 27 does hit. Roll that damage. Cool. Sorry, Sam. I, did I still have a swift action at the end of that, all that biz that I, I did? No? So. OK. <laughs> but at the end of the round, you're going to get like a bunch of damage to roll. I just don't want to. Oh, it's all good. Carry on. 20. 20. Uh, 21. 21. Whoa. OK. Cutting numbers. <laughs> uh, yeah, you hit him. Uh, and 21 does break his threshold as he looks staggered back from the shot. You see part of his armor fall away. Ooh. All right, we're moving on from Wick to their turns. They're going to move some quick turns here. Uh, they're gonna, one of them's going to attempt to disarm this device. Uh, and <laughs> they fail, which means it goes off prematurely. Oh. <laughs> oh. So do I roll? Boom. Like Please it goes off like right now? I roll 12d6. <laughs> what? I don't, even, I don't know if I have 12d6 here. What's the, hit. we'll just on it. We'll do six. All of them. Your droid friend's safe. Uh, so, oh, oh that's uh, is, six, 12. Asking for a friend. Oh, yeah. no. <laughs> 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. Uh, 26. Oh, geez. Uh, what's 26 plus 18? Uh, 18, <laughs> 26 plus 24. Uh, 26 plus 29 is uh, 55 points Ooh. of damage. 55 points of damage. Of, of uh, yeah, energy damage. Yeah. You see this, like, uh, you see, like, it's on me, it's on me, get it! No! <laughs> <laughs> Blast, yep. it's a corridor as pink mist is created. <laughs> out. Like that scene, like, like that scene in Akira? Like, yeah. Yeah. Just, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Nice. <laughs> All Good one, boys. Taken out as you are able to now advance to the hangar bay. Great. Oh, wow. Great. All right. Can I take a can uh, we, uh, second wind? Can we pilfer through the second medic? Wind, yes. OK. Can I will also we can pilfer from the medic? All, uh, from the medic? Yes, yeah. there's a med pack. That's 25 that points. That was unused. Yeah. <laughs> Slightly taking charred, the, but it's in a protective casing. So taking good. the med pack. All right. Well. That's all the time we have for today. Oh! Yeah. Yeah. Or not next week. One shot. It was an or not. It was or an or not. Or not. Or not. I or not. cannot tell you how excited I am for the hangar within. We've got those scientists, some X Wings, the Bad Batch are racing you there right now Yeesh. in a little bit more severe of a situation than you are, but they're Force Nine, Clone Force 99. So. Woo. Nine, nine. See how they do um, next week when we come back. Uh, yeah, we're going to reveal that map next week. So uh, make sure you tune in on YouTube. You can catch our recap anytime there on our YouTube channel at A Filthy Lot. Uh, you can also tune in on Twitch all week long. Questline. For Filthy Questline. That's right. Um, and uh, yeah, so stay safe, everyone, and keep rolling. Be with you. you. Be the fourth be with us all.